Welcome to Trivially Prompted, Shadowrun Edition, the game show that uses Jeopardy questions to force my friends Funk and Lazy Purple to fight my other friends Salty Fish and Yi for your entertainment. The rules are simple. Pick a category and answer some questions, get it right, and win some points. Then, do a prompt for bonus points or force it on the other team for no additional gain. Refuse to do the prompt and you face the Shadow Realm, or the Punishment Wheel. At least that's what I told them. In truth, once the game ends, their scores are turned into life points and they face the Shadow Realm's horrors in a final gambit for victory. Welcome to my game. Uh, let's see. How do we want to decide who goes first here? Does anyone have a preference? Does anyone want to choose? Yes. Me. Let's play rock, paper, scissors. Nose goes to the last... Nose... I guess that wouldn't really work. Wait, wait, wait. Or two will just think of a number and we guess... Okay, yeah, let's yeah, think yeah. of a number one through three. What? No. Yeah. Two. <laughs> Why? I'm thinking of the number three. Uh, I was guessing the number two. All right, Funks, Lazy, Woo! you're up. Fish. Yi, where was your participation? Fair. Wait, did wait, did that go through? I didn't. <laughs> I didn't say anything. You guys won the game already. It's over. <laughs> so I got it. I got us covered. All right. Also, uh, a side rule: uh, if you get okay. three in a row correct because they're too easy, uh, it will switch to the other team just so people don't monopolize all the, mm. all the words and whatnot. Let's start. So. Let's start simple. I want to do rock paper scissors for one hundred. Okay, rock paper scissors for one. Can I ask who's on my on team? Three. I am that brain dead right now. It's, if it's you look you at the bottom fun. of the screen, it will be. Oh, let's go. <laughs> let's go, fuck. <laughs> All right, let's go. I actually I didn't want to tell him just to see what he would do as it goes on because all these prompts are 2v2. <laughs> all right, so rock, paper, scissors is pretty straightforward. All you have to do is figure out what fits in the rock, paper, scissors here because shield beats projectile. Projectile beats what? What beats shield? Are, are we allowed to discuss internally before answering or is it you say it and that's your guess? You can, until you agree on it. You guys are good to discuss however long you want. Okay. I would figure that it's actual, like, actual squishy flesh, like actual damage to a body. Okay, well, hold on. Here, here's what I would say. I think it's mace, because I don't think skin beats shield, but it needs to beat shield. Oh, I see what you're saying. And I don't I think sword, saying. I don't think sword beats shield, but I do think a mace would, or like a, wrong, a, a heavy object. Yeah, I didn't They're see wrong. that. It's, uh, so it'll, wait, it'll, okay. it's either so mace or hammer. I think. And this is real life, right? This is not like Overwatch brain rot. It Dude, I don't know. Like it's rock, paper, scissors. I'm guessing here. Okay, okay. But that's my guess. Okay, uh, project shield. I'll give you a hint. Child. Think video games. That's. Well, I'm more okay. confident in my answer then. Yeah, I can agree because even in Overwatch, a mace gets through a shield. Although, so I, I like there, your. There is one alternative, and that's magic. Hmm. <laughs> Like in a video game, you it's know, projectile be magic. It in could. some games, if it, it, it's like hypothetical, like I could see the logic of there's bullet damage, there's magic damage, and then there's, you know, armor. Mm -hmm. And like, armor beats bullet, but mm -hmm. magic beats armor. I like the train of thought. Well, bullet yeah, beating magic is a is a bit of a. It's a bit of a stretch for me. Well, hold I on. Like, if you, like... if hold on, hold on. I'll if make it if I pull out a magic, desert magic eagle and shoot would be... Gandalf, he's gonna bleed. <laughs> no, I know. I get it. I get this it. Like that much end. we can agree. All on. this for a hundred points. Wizards are historically squishy. Points, I... okay, historically, we, we just have to go with something and see what kind of answers Two Bold is coming with. I say magic. All right. You say magic. The answer is. Uh, it's actually a throw. It's a throw. We're looking for throws. This yeah, is a fighting game. Yeah, I was close. Yeah, I knew game. that. I knew Could that. Could not be me. <laughs> yeah, this is a, this is a oh, fighting game. Oh, you can't. You can't. It's this, what you this guys guy just hasn't did. seen my magic flip clearly, <laughs> but I'll, I'll okay. accept Okay. All right. Okay. All right. So you guys, uh, you guys got that one wrong, but don't worry. It's not the end of the world. Now you just have to do this prompt of two Italians arguing over whose grandmother's sauce is the best. <sighs> That was the prompt, Tubal. That's what you wanted. What is this? What is that made up Italian? What did you guys say? You didn't put on Italian as usual. Boobity boppity. Repeatedly. Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm 23% Italian. Yes, me too. Oh my god. 
Please don't. Oh, okay. Please don't yeah, disagree exactly. with the we, council. We you know what? Right to do you this. know what? That's entirely on me. You're so right. Very well. Mm -hmm. You know, what? I'll accept that. Very good. No points extra lost here. Good job, boys. But I'm 23.1 percent Italian. So if you want to go after anybody, go after Foden. 23.1 percent. Man, he's got it down to the decimal. Man, point. you're pulling rank on me right now. <laughs> you're pulling All rank right. Cicelli on me. Uh, Fish Yee, which one would you guys like to do? Ye, I threw already. It's your turn. All right, who's that Pokemon for 100? That's what it's all about. All right. That's what it's all about. Who's that Pokemon? All you have to do is fill in the blank with the Pokemon name that finishes the sentence. This smells terrible, like a feline. Possibly piss. I just don't know which. So you're saying it's... Fish? <laughs> this smells terrible, like a feline. Possibly piss. I just don't know which. So you're saying it's... This looks so it, hard. It looks hard, but I promise after the first 100s of each section, you will completely understand all of them. This smells terrible, like a feline possibly pissed. This doesn't look hard. It is hard. What the yeah. f does this mean? <laughs> it like You'll understand. Like a, You'll understand. So it, it's a rhyme. It has to be. It has to. No, no, no. It finishes the sentence. Oh. Okay, it is hard. He's right. I tried to give you the benefit it, of the doubt. No, it's, no, no, no. It's a, you'll understand this after after the first. This smells terrible. One, I promise. Like a feline, possibly piss. I just don't know which. So you're saying it's. And then Pokemon name here. It's a cat, disgusting Pokemon. Isn't Meowstic a Pokemon? You. You're close. You got the first There's part. Meowth. There's Meowstic. There's. Persian. You think nope. You're thinking too hard. It's oh, you're oh, trying sorry, to you trying to use these hints. two. You're Guys, just to use remember, these two. remember what the answer from the last one was, and operate on that logic. It's throw. <laughs> oh, throw, throw. <laughs> no, it's not throw. It's not throw. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> It's actually the Pokemon Throw. Yes, you got it correct. That's incredible. I had no idea that you guys were yeah. so, so intelligent about this. What a good Pokemon. Socket and Throw. Um. You give up. You just say whatever Pokemon you want. You have want. to guess. You know more Pokemon than me. You play Poke Doodle every day. What's it called? Are they allowed to give up? This is not a This is bullshit. Can we oh. enter Steel? No. Yeah, sure. Why not? What? I'm not. No, what? to be clear, I'm not asking to. I was just for the sake of curiosity. If they can't right, figure then. out anything and give up entirely, I'll allow you guys to Steal. We can't. And if they if enough. they give up and we don't take the chance, they they we don't lose points, up. right? They stay at zero. Oh no no no! They definitely lose the points still. Hmm. Do we lose if we get it wrong after no. a steal? No. If they give up and you choose to steal, you you don't you, you have no risk no. other than to. Oh, yeah. What's your opinion? What's oh, your opinion on the it. answer, Sir Skit? Um um, I was thinking Charizard. Okay, I was thinking, you know, they're kind of similar. Uh, let's guess Charizard. What? Okay, yeah, good guess. <laughs> Uh, so unfortunately, it's cat oh, or pee. This, dude? We oh, didn't get this. It's cat oh, or pee. Oh, come on. Oh, right, right. See, so you get it. You get it now. You, you get can't it, overthink so. it. Take like it a feline, literally. possibly piss. I just don't know which. So you're saying it's cat or pee? <laughs> I understand this game now. Get it? I, I'm too tired for this. Let's go. <laughs> All right. Yeah, ye fish, you guys lose that one. But you get to answer the prompt now. Two pirates deciding which landmarks and unit of measurement to use to bury their treasure. Yar. It's about 2,000 centimeters port forward. <laughs> which way Yar. shall we head? Centimeters. Are you miles? <laughs> Yar. Miles. Miles. Centimeters is the way to go. Look at this map right here. It's about 200 centimeters. What about now, the millimeters? <laughs> I've never heard of this millimeter you're speaking of. Centimeters is what I grew up on. <laughs> you. <laughs> All right, that'll oh be fine. Good, good job. Good Metric job. I like that system one. user that's only heard of centimeters. <laughs> <laughs> I think that pirates mistaking the distance on the physical map for the real distance. <laughs> in the world. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You know, I, I think that's How pretty How was that great. a caterpie? Can I, can you explain? Wait, can I hear you? Wait, wait, wait. Okay. This, smells Cat, this smells terrible. Like a feline, possibly piss. I just don't know which. So you're saying it's cat or pee? That's so, oh my God. Cat you guys ever pee. played the impossible cat quiz? Cat or pee. Yeah, Throwbacks. I have played the impossible quiz. You got it? You get the idea? I get I it. I get it. I get it. <laughs> That was not in a hundred, by the way. That should have been five hundred. You're you're right. I did put up. it there mostly to get the game to you know 
start off with prompts. That's that's about it. But don't worry. Mm, every single one hundred, every single one hundred basically tells you how the rest of them go. Except mm -hmm. what my girlfriend calls these monsters. That one's just funny, and that one's for me. So that's uh that's up for you guys. All right. So uh, lazy funk you shadow guys? realm for 100 please shadow realm is actually a bonus one you are not allowed to oh. pick this one that's Yikes. if you re refuse all the rest of them he wasn't listening I w oh, i'm sorry coach it's okay uh the <laughs> comment section for 100 video. comment section for 100 all right i can't believe that one of these creatures could kill osama <laughs> bin laden now basically what this is it shows you a comment left on a video and you just have to tell me what you think that video is about if you're very close you get the point you don't have to be exact you just have to be in the same I, the same vein as the answer. So what do you I, think would be the video that warranted this? So obviously my mind's on Pokemon, but I don't think anyone would be in disbelief that a Pokemon could kill Osama Bin Laden. This is like, that's a razor's edge of a creature that is, is hard to believe that they could kill a person. I think uh, it's a documentary on U.S. politicians. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> I, I see it. Very literal. One of these but... creatures. One of these creatures. You know, but, take, the, the, but I'm then taking the it literally. The phraseology mm -hmm. of that makes it sound like they feel bad for Osama. I can't believe one of these creatures could do that to him. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe they could kill him. Like... I guess it's... Okay, let's go off of context clues. Mr. Waffles has a... Uh, Is that Dead Space? Dead Space, Dead Space Isaac icon. Mm -hmm. So maybe it's, uh, you know, a Dead Space Markiplier playthrough. It's got but 143 again, upvotes. That's a lot. I certainly but, would believe that a dead space monster could kill Osama bin Laden. What, where's this disbelief coming from, and how sarcastic is it? How do you yeah, how do you come to up say. to this comment? What? It's okay. It's this okay. This could be any again, video. This could be any fucking video. Again, the answer. after the, the answer. hundred, you'll understand. Okay. 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 You know what? I'm. I want to run with the logic that like. I want to run with the logic that it's almost he can't believe that they had like the will to do it. Not that they're physically capable of it, but that they had the will. I can't believe one of these mm. creatures could do it and live with themselves. <laughs> right. <laughs> How could he live with the with the idea of killing this like, terrorist? Or, I have no what idea. If, what if it's all built on that thing that Osama bin Laden lives underground in a tunnel and it's something about like moles? You know what I think it is. What? Do you guys were do you remember when like they found Osama bin Laden's hard drive and they, it had CS:GO on it? Oh, I, I did I think not know that. I think it's like a CS:GO. It's like a CS:GO match. You know what? If that's a real thing, I'm I'm willing to send that. It's okay. the only it could, lead I have. It could be the like the only a, the only hint I'm going to give you guys is that in in the comment here, it just says creatures. One of these creatures. I, I know the answer. answer. It's so a you're, video. You're, There's typically 10 to 30 creatures in a video. Well, I, I, mean, I think, it, I think he's trying steal? to be literal, though, because we're interpreting creatures as like, oh, look at these like uh, free-to-play new CSGO creatures. All right. Uh, but now he's trying to emphasize the word. I bet it's an animal. I bet it's just a random animal, and they're making Let me guess. What if it's like a mole? What if it's a thing that can dig underground? So, ha -ha, you guys have 10 is seconds. Horizontal. I, like that. Right. I like that answer. Okay, I'm going with some, it's kind of some kind of uh, animal nature. It's an animal they're talking about that can dig. A digging animal. All right. Final answer. Uh, unfortunately, no. It's a it's a seal. <laughs> seal we team six. Though. It's a Come seal on. team six, guys. Wait, it's, it's an animal. Oh, oh, I get. It. Dude, I was like ten when this happened. <laughs> yeah. I knew this. <laughs> Well, you actually knew that. I thought you. Yeah, were I was literally, no, I was saying Seal yeah. Team Six. Seal of course, Team a Seal six. video. I can't That's believe funny. one of these creatures could kill Osama bin oh. Laden. That makes sense. If you had That's just nice. said animal, creature. I might have just not taken points from you. But you said a digging animal, and that's just, it's too far yeah. off. From I'm sorry. So I would right. argue Sunday. they dig through the sea, but whatever. <laughs> Pass. It's just called swimming at that point. We get mm. to make it a whole different activity. But tomato, yeah, anyway, here's your, uh, here's your prompt. Brock trying to talk some sense into Ash after his ninth loss in the Pokemon League. So you guys get to decide who's who. I can Brock do Brock. To... Yeah, you why, do you guys know Pokemon at all? I really think this is the one. I think 10th is my go. Ash, Ash, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. You're no, not, I've got an you're idea. You're not him. You're I not understand. him. I figured it out, Brock. I've I understand. Tried. I've been the here first the whole person time. I fight always runs ice. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna evolve my Bulbasaur. 
<laughs> no ass. I'm gonna send and Venusaur. It, no, it's gonna be it evolved, been? Brock. How long has it been? And you don't know what what is Bulbasaur gonna do against? Brock, ice? it's been it's been 13 days. 13 days. I haven't Since aged when? at all. <laughs> <laughs> what, you, what you think it's been a year? Have you not learned anything? Wait, are you telling it me that you even... only processed information from 13 of the past 382 days? No, what I'm saying is ninth times the try. Do you know what fire is, little buddy? Do you have you seen a fire Pokemon? I, All right, I, that's good. That's good. <laughs> it's 382 days is not a year. It's over well, a year. <laughs> it's more than a year. Oh man, this is amazing. That was that was exactly how I hoped that that prompt would go. Fantastic. <laughs> All right, no lo no more extra lost points for you guys. So good stuff. All right, Yi Fish, what would you like? Turn. All right, give me the comment section for <clears throat> 200. All right. Oh God. Close your eyes for full screen. Oh, we just got you. Oh, that's this a layup. Is, this is that's so, so easy. Close your eyes. That's not even in English. What is that? Close your eyes for full screen. Hmm. What is could this video, video be about? Of of like, well, this is the discussion. We're not guessing. This is uh -huh. like a, a white noise uh, video where it's just. Mm. Let's look at the. Let's look at the clues. Mm, so the yes, profile picture approach. is a Maximilian Most profile picture. You know what is I bet it is? I bet it's one gone. of those 10 hour videos disrupted by something, like a metal pipe noise. It's because oh, it's definitely not a full video. Ooh. Close your eyes for a full what screen. What if it's like a, a no, no, wait, no gameplay? No, I think it's just, I think it's just a black screen. It and could also be like a blind joke. Close your eyes for a full screen. They said it was a layup. I can't and they know. Team. They definitely know. Two thousand two <laughs> comma one T period. What the hell, dude? Okay, this is a very popular comment. <laughs> He's looking for two thousand <laughs> two comma one T. <laughs> <laughs> like a needle in a haystack, isn't it? <laughs> like what is Kukata sitting? Is that years, weeks, it's hours? It, yeah, no, that would help how, how recently this was taken. Yeah, that would help, actually. But unfortunately, it's our team. This is... Believe um, it or not, all you need for context is exactly what is written. Close your eyes for full screen. I think it's just a black <laughs> screen. I think it's 10 hours of black screen. That's what I think it is. You... Can we give a more specific answer once they log in? If you, if you want. 10 or... hours of black screen occasionally um, disrupted by metal pipe noise. That's what I think it is. <laughs> all right, is that okay. locked in, final answer? Yeah, yeah that's are we locking their final that in? answer. Yeah, sure, I'm doing sure. more. Right, we're locking that in. It's ten hours. Black screen has something to sleep to. All right, let's see who oh. got it closest. Uh, it's ten hours of nothing Ooh. at all. No, nothing dude. at all. However, it was their prompt, and they did technically get it correct. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I, yeah. I just let's want to see go, what you guys baby. Say, We got so. ten hours. We got the ten hours. Took three minutes to lock in. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> So congratulations, Fish and uh, Yi. You guys got the first positive amount of points. So Let's now you go. have the chance to do the prompt or force it on to Lazy and Purple. Or Lazy and Funk. Wait, Mike Tyson mm. getting upset I don't know what Mike Tyson... Speech. I forgot what he sounds like. He sounds like this. That's exactly correct. It's <laughs> <laughs> a good prompt. <laughs> Are you making fun of me? I will introduce and the left side of my fist to the right side of your face. Let's make it happen. <laughs> Come on, you. I'm paying <laughs> you good money. Wait, okay, okay, pause, 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 pause. <laughs> All right, sure. Uh, Fisher, how do you do a lisp? How do you do a lisp? You just, I just put my tongue underneath my teeth and Literally speak. just say a letter wrong. <laughs> That's what a lisp is. Like this. <laughs> <laughs> Stop mocking me. <laughs> you were recommended by all my people. Like I said, I'll knock you right in the face if you right. keep making fun of me. You're old. I'm trying to help you. <laughs> you're trying to help me. You you're came you're to making this worth. Help. You're making this worth. I'm going to punch you right here. <laughs> here. Have some of this. Have some of this. <laughs> Feel that, doctor. Right. Yeah, I'm professional. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> you All right, clocked that's, by Tyson. That's perfect. That's perfect. Good, right, good speech therapy with just... Rocky Balboa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that that fits. I'm trying to help you. <laughs> oh God! Well done. Well done. That was funny stuff. Positive. Yeah, good stuff. You got your bonus points and everything. All right. Uh, go. You guys go again. Your call phone. Oh, should we go no, again? No, no, no. That's nope. fishing. Fishing. You got it right. They get to go again. Well, I mean, the comment um, section going well uh, for us. You uh, we do 300? Yeah, yeah. Let's try All it right, again. 300 comment section. Uh, pick it up with your hands, you pussy. Pick it up with your hands, you pussy. <laughs> <laughs> um, this hmm. one's a little more difficult. Again, you only have to get pretty, like, in the same vein. Five months ago, 600 likes. No profile picture. 93 replies so it is absurd that's a weird ratio 600 likes to 93 replies um i love that you guys are trying to use context clues for this i, think, I didn't even factor that in and it's still very funny <laughs> i think it's some sort of tutorial on how to use chopsticks or how to eat food with chopsticks mm. um that's that's what i'm taking from this what do you think, i want to try to steal this one once they lock in what do you think you you know those uh, recent videos of uh, people cleaning up dirty houses? Oh, what if it's like yeah. a cleaning video? <laughs> That's a good guess, too. And they're telling them to pick it up with their hands. Mm -hmm. Like one of those lawn mowing videos? Yeah, with their bare hands. Okay, which one do we think is better? Chopsticks or cleaning house? None of them. Yeah, you're probably, probably something else. <laughs> um, <laughs> pick it up with your hands, you pussy. Yeah, I think we're gonna. You know, what, let's go with you. We're gonna we're gonna lock in Yee's answer. Some sort it's of cleaning cleaning, cleaning yeah, yeah. your house or cleaning video. Okay, I want to yeah. steal. Hand, my yeah. hands up. My hands up. You can't steal unless they don't lock in an answer at all because they've been going for too long. But I will let you guess if you really want to. They're not allowed to like change it after they. No, they mine, can't right? change it. No. Uh, Just I to see if you're a, right. I think it's a landmine. Wrong. Okay, okay. Or like a dormant grenade. That is such a good guess. Uh, it's actually a red-hot cannonball and water and ice. <laughs> so the closest was actually lazy and uh, funk. So that would be that would be theirs if they got it. But you guys went with cleaning. That's not quite the same vein, so you're going to lose points on that one. But... It is pretty funny to think that it's just you cleaning a... I knew it was old. Cleaning a random thing. Man, you can tell by yeah. the, the look you can of the tell? comment. The, the look of the comment. All right. You so your prompt is this. God talking to a devout atheist. All right. You be God, ye. Oh. I can't hear it. <laughs> hey. My child. I'm here. You're not my father. My father abandoned me at age 10. But Explain you, that, you God. You, you, you said you couldn't hear my ass, you bitch. What's going on? Well, yeah. You're just... Probably above me somewhere. So I'm not real, but suddenly so I'm talking to you, and now you're acting like I didn't exist before. But now yeah, you're I'm my so upstairs dumb. neighbor. You're always loud as f banging on the doors at 1 a.m. in the morning. Well, I'm sorry, I'm getting f crucified. I'm, that's not my choice. <laughs> crucified? Yeah, I'm God. I'm Jesus. It's, hmm. Uh. Well, I don't believe in you. Regardless. It, it seems as though it would take more than one day. It happens every night. You're telling me that happens every night? Explain that in the Bible. You're talking to me, please. I'm talking to my upstairs neighbor, and it's about to be more than talking if you keep this up. Please, my child, if you just believe in me. I I'm not your child. So Again, better. my father left me at age my 10. My child, you are You're nothing not. but a child. I don't believe. I never will. You're just a little bitch. There's an explanation for everything. <laughs> I'm a man of science. You. Like, why? I'm just here to help you, man. <laughs> All right. Get the <laughs> little bit. Scene. Yeah. End of scene. Were you <laughs> implying that God is being crucified in heaven? <laughs> every night. Every night at 1 a.m. he was being crucified in that's the like, apartment above me. It's like an atheist going through the stages of grief. Like, you're not real. Okay, you're real, but I don't like you. Okay, I don't <laughs> like you, but... Uh, that was that was way better than I hoped. I love ye being God. That's pretty good. You're just a child, you little bitch. <laughs> I'm sure that's All what right. God's thinking in his head. He just doesn't say it out loud. Mm -hmm. The inner machinations of God's mind are an enigma to us. I think All we right. go for a 200 to even the score. We could do a 300, but that's risky. Could be a lot of debt. What do you think? 
Uh, yeah, your call. I agree. All right. How about uh, rock, paper, scissors for 200? All right, rock, paper, scissors for 200. Duck beats bread. Bread beats what? And what beats duck? I think it's mm. fist. I think it's throw. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well. I think it's a throwing fist, a fist being thrown. Uh, 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 uh. Agree, disagree. Processing. I, I, what if bread makes people fat and and people beat duck? Well, then the arrows would be spun around, but they're clearly not. Hey, what are you talking about? Bread, bread would beat person. Bread would beat per. Uh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. I see the logic there. And if it was white bread, hmm. But what if this is whole wheat bread? You know. Yeah. You know. The variables. Be... What beats duck? That's that is a very important question here. A uh, car tire, <laughs> but I don't. I don't see bread. how bread would be car tire as a thing. Oh brother, I just feel like I'm stuck on person because it's people throwing the bread in this situation. Like duck beats bread, but duck can't make bread. Person has to bring bread. Okay, remember we can't overthink this. Oh. Like I've learned, th it, it take the. First two answers, throw them out. Pick the third one, and that's mm. always the answer. My mm. third answer mm. is fist and or person. Can we, like, we can merge the answers. Just say, like, you know, human body. I'll Why allow does it bread beat close. fist? Because fat. Wait, so you're just going with person? <laughs> I, I don't, because, like, you fill a hand with bread, and then it can't do anything. You beat it, you know? Like, why does paper beat rock? It wraps be around the rock. People beating duck also makes so little sense. What what eats a duck? What is a natural yeah, have predator? Have you ever fought a duck before? They're <laughs> pushovers. <laughs> you know, you're right. Fine. Are you it's, implying it's, you maybe fought it, multiple ducks? It's logical. It's rational. It's uh, understandable. It's either that or fire. And I Red. don't want to go with my second answer. Red doesn't beat fire. I'll... Let's just, let's just go with guy. We go with guy, please. We go with guy. What is guy? Lock the answer in. is, in fact, man. Woo! You did it. Well done. Yes. Right. Bread let's makes see. you fat, but man beats duck, and duck eats bread. So that's uh, that's pretty straightforward, I think. Well done, boys. Good stuff. Get no fat from eating duck too, though. Yeah, but I mean, it's more likely you eat it from it's a cars. Bit harder. Yeah. yeah. Plus, you have to go and find a duck, and you can just get bread. Anyway. The you prompt. Find wheat. So anyway. what, we, what benefit do we get from this? Do we double our points if we choose to do it instead of passing the prompt? Yep. Okay. So two guys in a horror movie debating to split up or not. I think we should split up. I think that the, I saw a door down the hallway with a bunch of, of plates sitting in front of it. I should go that way. You should go towards the, the basement. Are you crazy? It, it, we have to stick together. No, I think about it. It's going to take us like 40 minutes to cover this whole house if we go together. And I kind of have a thing in 20 minutes. Like I have I have to go um, pull some bread out of the oven. You know, I live next door. And I just you, I can't miss that. You haven't been feeding the ducks, have you? No, uh, to be honest, they've they've been growling and, and getting really big. So I, um, you know, I, I just sort of opened the, the back gate uh, and, you know, the neighbors went missing and that's why we're here. But, uh, but I think if you check the basement and I check, uh, you know, the, the, the mysterious dark closet down the hallway, I, I think we'll find him in one of those spots. How about you check the basement and I'll see if he's in the police station. I like that. I like that. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You, and, okay. <laughs> we'll, we'll meet back here in 15 minutes. All right. See you then. Okay. Ah! I love how lazy immediately, <laughs> immediately switched together. up. Let's <laughs> I guess we're splitting up. I was very convincing. <laughs> I love the exposition. The people went missing, but also I've been feeding a lot of ducks. They're pretty <laughs> mad. I was, I was trying I to merge so the lost. plot points. <laughs> All right. Well done. Which uh, which one would you like next? How about you pick it, lazy? Uh, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, um. Oh, we haven't done sayings or phrases for 100. Let's keep it going. Okay, sayings or phrases for 100. So all you have to do for this one is tell me what exactly the saying means. All right? I'd say he's tickled pink, but the boy's colorblind. What it means? Mm -hmm. Like, this is a, ma is a made-up saying, right? Like, not... not... Yep. 
This one's made what up. What does the saying represent? Mm hmm I think it means, like, someone can't get excited. Like, they're depressed. Like, he, this guy can't get tickled pink. He must be X, and X is depressed. Well, the thing is, is why would you say he's tickled pink then? Because th you need to have some kind of uh, input for that first part of the sentence. It needs to be that, like, he is tickled pink, and I'd say he is, but the boy is a But that's literally what it says. I, oh, wait, I, he's I'll... tickled... It, tickled tickled pink. pink. So the implication is tickled colorless. Right. So it's. So that is the the modifier. Colorblind is the modifier of tickled pink. Yes. So it's he such a is scientific tickled approach. Pink, but there's something there's something wrong with the boy. He's unable to be tickled a, a particular color. <laughs> what is what is uh... disabling this boy's ability to get tickled? I, I think it's. <laughs> It's just that they are tickled pink, like they are they are excited and having a good time, but you're also just making fun of the fact that they're colorblind and you're really forcing it. <laughs> Maybe it's just very literal. <laughs> like it's a, it's a colorblind boy who's very happy. <laughs> just people all his life trying to force colorblind jokes, and this is one of many. Yeah, I think this is a meta commentary on how we judge others. Uh, hmm. Through our own eyes, and in reality, we're the colorblind ones. I'd like yeah, to answer yeah. meta Damn. meta Damn. commentary. <laughs> All right. Meta, meta <laughs> commentary on I'm, perception I'm, of strangers. I'm not sure that's where we were going. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, Let me know I'd whenever like to, you guys are done deciding. I'd like to say it's it's quite literal that he is he is the meaning of tickled pink, but he is also colorblind, and it's just a shoehorned insult. <laughs> it's very literal. <laughs> very I don't mind that. All right, so you're going with the meta commentary or the literal commentary? Which one would you like? I I'm going literal. I'm leaning literal. Okay, literal. Uh, the answer is uh, nothing. I just think it's funny because I made this one up entirely on my own. Uh, you guys uh, so, were pretty close, that, though. That I must count. It. Yeah, that literal must count. Had, I, literal is correct, then. I literal enjoyed implies it, there which is, is literally meaning. all that was the criteria for me giving you points for this one since I just made it up, is if I was entertained by your thought process, which I was. So you guys, you guys <laughs> okay. get this one. Freebie. Love freebie. <laughs> so two cowboys in a town that really is big enough for both of them. All right, hold up, hold on, hold up. <clears throat> hey, partner! Hey, partner! <laughs> How's the weather over there? Oh, it's great. You know, the grass is so green. It's getting a little high, but I know you don't mind. You got plenty of your own. I bet the grass is greener over there. Hey, you want to come over for a movie? I know you got a movie theater, but mine's got uh, some nicer know, seats. Don't take it the wrong way, but I trust you as far as I can throw you, and that's about that far. <laughs> oh, I'd shoot you if you weren't 2.5 miles away, boy. I was thinking the same thing, but you know I'm not that great a shot. My daddy never taught me. All right, well, I'll be seeing you in the next seven months when I wander within uh, focal distance of you. All right, don't, uh, act, like, act like a stranger. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That was fantastic. Well done. Act like a stranger. <laughs> very good, very good. All right, you guys get one more. Which one would you like? Good question. You're we, should. we haven't done what my girlfriend calls these monsters, yeah, we've been afraid I feel of like we shouldn't leave that out. Maybe we play it safe, do 100 on that. Don't risk yeah, sure. a lot. We're already sure. ahead. 100 for uh, girlfriend monsters. All right. What well, my girlfriend calls this monster. Don't think too hard. That's the only hint you get. I mean, lizard guy, but he's not even a guy. <laughs> lizard uh, dinosaur. Steve. Oh my, my god, are we going in that direction? She's not is she even trying to like I will give you oh, a hint. I don't know. It is not a literal name. It's not a literal okay, name. Okay, okay, okay. Uh li li lizard chew. <laughs> <laughs> it's yellow. Oh my goodness. I all I see is a lizard. My brain can't derive any other information <laughs> from this. Uh, lizard boy. Uh, th thinly fast men. <laughs> Leave fast <laughs> man. <laughs> What's your answer? What would you like? Well, I would have gone with Steve if not for the the clue. And now it's it's I I lizard chew is my only guess, but I don't. It's hard to say. I mean, he's kind of got an, a pharaoh thing going on at the eye. Maybe he's Egyptian lizard. 
But that's we're. I think we're complicating it. It's just a freaking lizard. A Lizzie. What if we just go with like Lizzie? Lizzie. But that's that's a name. That is a that's a nickname. Damn. Uh, like we just have to see what, what what this category is. I'm going lizard boy. I I don't mind lizard boy. Okay. All right, locking in Lizard Boy, and the correct answer is Lizard. Yeah, correct. You got it. All right. It's just okay. Lizard. <laughs> My lizard. brain was not <clears throat> betraying me. This is yeah. actually a, a Jagras from Monster Hunter. Most, uh, I'm going to give you a, a big hint here. All the monsters are from Monster Hunter because that's what we've been playing, and uh, yeah. she always yeah. calls them pretty interesting names. But, uh, yeah, this guy's just Lizard. That He's makes sense. Lizard. If it's not actually a Lizard, then Lizard is therefore a, a, a nickname. Mm -hmm. He's just Lizard. A foolish His actual one name is that. Jagras, but there you go. Uh, yeah, parent-teacher conference, but both the teacher and the parent are snooty. Hmm. Yeah, your child has been, um, well, let's say not paying attention, and I get the feeling that, you know, you're used to that and you don't seem mm -mm. to mind. Well, you know, sometimes <laughs> the teacher betrays the issue. My yeah. sweet boy has an A in math. You know what he doesn't have an A in your class. I wonder where it's happening there. Yeah, well, I get I get the feeling he doesn't have an A in hugging his uh, parental figure, does he? Probably. Actually, we've been grading him so since you he was five. About, no, no, we have we about, we've read all the books. We read all the books, and grading him on hugging was chapter one. And you would know that if you knew anything about raising a kid. Yeah. I thought you would as a teacher. Well, I you grade that, huh? your your face as about a D minus, and your son's uh, frankly an F. And you know what? I'm okay with that because I'm detached from my uh, bodily form and all the consequences of living within uh, a body. And, and yeah, you, know... you seem to be detached from the treadmill too. But I, I'm happy that it's not bothering <laughs> you. Know, I'm, I'm a bit detached from this conversation. Uh, in fact, right, I'm out well, of here. I'm about, I'm about to detach my fist from your face. <laughs> right, Ow! Fantastic. Well done, it's Mike well Tyson done. again. <laughs> 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 well done, well done. You guys get your points. Uh, for both, I think. There you go. All right. Uh, that's three for you guys. So, Fish and Yi, you guys are up now. Good luck following that up. Do you want to try Pokemon, Fish? Yes. Yeah, let's give Pokemon a chance. Two hundred. Which one? Yeah, wait, or should we catch up? Ooh, bro, we're not going to catch up. Yes, we are. We can at We've least get closer. Lost. Maybe, if we, maybe if we go three. If you get one two, right and we get one wrong, it, it's yeah, exactly. pretty close. Exactly. Let's go, exactly. Let's go so, for 200. All right. Who's that Pokemon okay, for 200? All right, all right. Does your mom cut vegetables? Nah. Chops them. I regret doing this. Oh, Ma chops them. He just gave us the answer. <gasps> I think he, you I literally that, said it. Ah, I said chop. What, what is my chop? What is my chop? That's on me. That's on me. That's on me. the points. What's <laughs> <laughs> the point? Yeah. Are the you <laughs> my bad, my bad. That's I'm out here me. working so hard. <laughs> now, let's just remember that these 200 points came from a dubious place. Let's just yeah, keep that in the back of our mind. If you win by a 200 margin, who's the real winner? <laughs> Still on. That's on me. That's on me. Fully my fault. Either way, the answer is my chop. Uh, I'd argue the they have to do the prompt now because of that. And they don't yeah, get bonus sure. points for it. Come on. You know, we'll see what we'll see what happens. An alien teleports into the biggest pyramid his scanner picks up what? and is greeted by a Bass Pro Shop employee trying to sell him a fishing rod. Now, the reason this is funny for context is that for some unknown reason, oh, Bass Pro Shop actually owns a giant glass pyramid that they yeah. have a giant store set up in. I don't know why. I didn't look that hard into it, but it made me laugh so hard I wrote this prompt. So there you go. Oh, my God. What is this big ass triangle? Uh, hey, hey, I, I see you. Welcome, welcome to Earth, first of Greetings, all. Greetings, fellow human. <laughs> oh, you're a human too. I, I, I saw you, you yes, dropped off yes, off that I UFO, human, so I, I just, yes. I assumed that you were not of this planet. No, I do not know what a UFO is. Anyways, how was your day? Well, <laughs> fellow human who also uh, uh, act, uh, is part of human activities, you need this fishing rod because I see you don't have one. So oh, uh, fishing. Yeah, that'll be two hundred dollars. But what is fishing? F you know what fishing is because you're a human. I do not have a father figure. What is fishing? <laughs> well, you see, when uh, you get on this boat, you need to eat, and the only way that we can survive is through food, which we catch with a fishing rod, which you need to buy for two hundred dollars off of me right now. Humans are so fascinating. 
Yeah, and um, I'm also fascinated in what's in your wallet. So I'm happy to be a human. I'm I'm great. I'm happy to also be human. So come on, cough it over, and uh, let's make this business transaction happen. All right, <laughs> good enough. Such a Wait, pushy base pro shot. What was the? What, I, I kind of. What did you say? What does this have to do with the pyramid scanner? And what? I've never heard of this. So I was mostly just a play on like aliens and the pyramids, right? But he's going to try and find a pyramid to land by, but it ends up being a bass pro shot because that's a, just a pyramid that's around for some reason. So I just the thought scanner it was fun. doesn't oh. matter in the prompt. That's just how the alien ended up at the base pro shot pyramid. Wait, yeah, I didn't I just know that. Funny. I didn't know that they're actually shaped like pyramids. Oh, no. That it's literally one like is. the third biggest pyramid in the world, I think. Oh, yeah. I had no really idea. What? I just Whoa. looked it up. It's hilarious. <laughs> it doesn't insane. make any sense. I don't know. I don't even know where they got that pyramid <laughs> for it. Who, who said, you know, put a Bass Pro Shop here? But it's a thing, and it's it made me laugh a lot. So Every There are, like, hotel fun. rooms at the end of it on the first few levels. <laughs> there really? So, yeah. I had a friend go there once. That is hilarious. All right. Well, either way, okay, uh, I didn't. I didn't know that going into. Okay. Yeah, you know, here you can. Here's, a, here's yeah. a freebie. There's a freebie for you. All right. <laughs> so, who's where? Wherever you want to go, you guys. Uh, two more. If you Pokemon going, again, right? Right. right? Sure, yeah. Man. Yeah. 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 Who's that Let's Pokemon for three hundred? <laughs> Let's take this lead. You always copy me. No, I don't. I blank. I peek at you. Right? Because it's like I, I, it's like I'm peeking, taking a peek at the answers, right? Oh my Ye? god, yeah. What is I peek at you? I'd like to steal. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. We don't want to lock it in. We don't want to lock it in. I wait, do wait, think wait. that's it. You always copy me. No, I don't. I peek at you. Peek at ride you. you. Wait, oh, ride. um, um. I wait, Charizard. <laughs> I squirt. Oh. I squirtle. Yes. Uh, I. <laughs> I squirtle. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. I mew. I mew. Oh my god. I mew too. I mew too. too. Wait, 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 wait. That could be it. I think it's I mew. Oh, Should we lock in mew too? I mew too. Mew too. Mew too is the end. We let, are we locking it in? <laughs> oh no. I think it, I think it could be me too. I'm you too. Go first gen. Oh god. I, he wouldn't take uh, it past first gen. He doesn't no, expect this to know. Mm. I think Come I think it has, I think it has to be me too. Ye, are we locking it in? Oh god! Oh god! I'm I'm you too. Yeah, I think it's I think it's I'm yeah. We're locking in me too. Okay. Locking it's mimic you. <laughs> oh fuck me, dude. <laughs> It's mimic no. you. Who knows I this mimic shit? you. <laughs> you two. Are I know funny. this shit. Me too. Me too. Okay. Yeah. Those you were exceptionally funny though. I will <laughs> just because I enjoyed that so much and because I peek at you could have been good and Mewtwo was funny. I will say you won't lose points, but you do have to do the prompt. Okay. I think Tubold would have chosen Mewtwo if he thought of it when writing that. I would have changed the prompt a bit. I was I was mostly definitely going for mimic you, just because copy oh, and yeah. mimic would be pretty good. But if I thought about no, Mewtwo I mean, and mewing, I 100 percent would have made the question about that. That's you what I'm saying. If you had correct. seen it that way, that yeah. would have 100 percent been it. 100 percent, 100 percent. All right. So uh, the two burglars in Home Alone, after they run into the fifth booby trap, one wants to keep going, the other does not. Have you guys seen this movie? Please tell me. Yes, seen yes. Okay, okay no, I got, no, no. I got. Okay, okay, okay. After the Look. last game show where Noah didn't know who Steve Irwin was, I trust nothing and no one anymore. Oh, brother. <laughs> <laughs> We've already fallen for four traps. Okay, we won't fall for the next one. Look, look, it's just a little survey. Okay. What? Oh, I could. I'm bleeding everywhere. <laughs> and that's fine. And that's fine. Here, look, look. It's asking us a question. What is your maiden's name? Like I could fall for that. I don't um, remember her name. It's Cecilia. Now, what could go wrong? Oh, it's a notification on my phone. Oh. I've lost everything. He, he took everything from me. Wait, is this still part of the prompt? He took everything from my <laughs> bank account. <laughs> what? <laughs> what prompt? What pro he, just, he just robbed us of everything we have. He's just this, a kid. This wasn't a physical booby trap. He's robbed me of everything. He <laughs> Do you want to run away? <laughs> I guess this was the home alone all along. 
Okay, stop. stop. <laughs> you called me Yee, dude. I didn't I forgot that part of the <laughs> It's a shame Home Alone came before two factor authentication. <laughs> oh, man. Why'd you use my government name? <laughs> my government Oh, my God. <laughs> I, I, I thought you got it. I love the you, implication that uh, your phone getting hacked somehow also, like, drained your, your friend's bank account. <laughs> 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 like, everything we have. What? <laughs> I just I love the idea that he's oh, using he, had, he left a survey in a house of booby traps so he could steal your your monetary wealth. <laughs> this poor this poor boy is just trying to defend his home. He's like, you know what? Maybe I could just rob them back. <laughs> uh, we're just in, in second place against guys getting answers wrong. It's it's great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but now you, it's your turn, so you get to all go. right. All right. Surely the rules will bend the other way. Hmm, you never know. I pick the last one right so mm, okay let's go sayings for 200 sayings for 200 so low you could sit on a dime and swing your feet this just so calling someone short that's it, that's what it seems like because you could sit on a dime and swing your feet it implies you're so tiny that your legs would overhang off the that dime that is microscopic yeah <laughs> <laughs> so low i mean hey, he could be five seven you never know Six for like six the phrasing is awkward because low. Given that it's supposed to be uh, a Jeopardy question, if it was a real saying, it would just be so short you could sit on a dive and swing your feet. It would not be so low. Like low is. Yeah, it almost seems like he's avoiding using the word short <laughs> because that would give away the answer, which yeah, is you know what short. you've actually you've you've yeah I double down now that you. Yeah, I see it. It's that way. way too awkward of a phrasing to not be avoiding giving the answer. Yeah, I think it's yeah, short. Okay, it's short. All right, final answer is short. And uh, no, it's actually feeling or doing really bad. He's feeling so, so low, low, you could sit on a dime and swim. Man. Your feet. Close, but very close. Low does not imply size or height. It's a, it's a feeling of uh, you feel so low. Like he's, yeah, uh, but he's if, depressed. being low doesn't make me microscopic. It's a it's a saying. Don't try and don't oh, try and take it yeah. too hard. It's one it's of those saying. classic sayings I shouldn't be arguing yeah. with. Right, right, right. Yeah, it's one of those it's one of those ones you hear from a southerner you're just like I don't know. But all right. Thank you for that. I'm just I'm just uncultured, my bad. It's okay. Not everyone can be from the deep south and hear the phrase so low you could sit on a dime and swing your feet all the time. <laughs> but I like the logic. I did like that. So okay. we got that going for you. But either way, prompt. Saint Peter at the Pearly Gates confused as to how this guy got here. Hey, asshole, you parked too close to me. It's, These two spots are mine. Excuse me, you... How is... You brought you brought your car. You must be quite the fella. Let's see. Let me take a look at your record here. Let's see, um... Hey, hey, oh. hey, hands off the merch. Oh, oh, my. Oh, my. Wait, there has to be a mistake here. You... Hey, you trying did, to get some did, tickets did, to the Mets? Can I, wait, hold on. Can I just I ask... I got one a, in my pocket Can I just here. ask a clarifying question? Did you die in your car? <laughs> Oh no, that's a misconception. I, uh, I actually hit four bystanders and then a, a, a telephone pole and then I flew out of it and the impact on the concrete was actually what, I, what killed me. I wasn't in the car. Did you have some kind of spiritual connection to the car? Is this the Pope Mobile you hijacked? Dude, why, and... are, you so, why are you so focused in on my BMW? I've, I've, I'm just trying to figure out one piece of this puzzle, okay? All right, so four people. Listen, asshole, That's I'm just asking we... you to back up a little bit. I don't want this thing to get dinked. Look, just don't push your luck. Four people, it's not that bad. We've got people in here with five under their belt. Like, if you just just keep this short and simple. Oh, hang on, I'm getting right? a call. Uh, it... <laughs> he's got reception right, in heaven. How did this guy get here? He's, he's taking oh, hey, a Kev. phone call in the middle of this conversation. Get uh, out of here. No, turn just around, burn, turn, just turn, cook no, the books no. a little bit. I, I can you get you up here. I know a guy. Do and walk away. Oh, oh, hold on, this asshole keeps away. yapping at me. <laughs> you brought the Boston out of St. Peter. You, you, no, you f***ed up. I'm going to go right. get better reception. Right. I like that one a lot. I like, the, I like the Bostonian accent. Real natural, real easy. I love St. Peter being so focused on how is their car here. <laughs> <laughs> I really was worried, weird. like, how am I going to make this guy an asshole? Oh, it, the car is all that matters. <laughs> Perfect. I, I love it. That was really, really good. <laughs> All right. Uh, you did kind of get that wrong, but I liked it so much. It gave you some points. So there you I'll go. Yay. Fishy. 
And feel free. Hmm. Well, you said you gave us points. We were already six hundred. You Yikes. lost the points for the for getting the thing. Right. Oh, it even. I see. I see. Net hey, zero. What if we were Fish? all boys and we continued down the Pokemon path? Ah, uh, we're going that route, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do it. Let's it do it. It just seems very reliable. All right, Pokemon for four hundred. Yes, yep. sir. All right. If I told you a story every day and two extra on the weekends, I'd have told you blank. If I told you a story every day and two extra. Now you get into the 400 territory. This is where things get difficult. Hmm. Oh, God. So it goes past Gen 1, which is horrifying. Um, I know it. No, you don't. No, you don't. I know it, too, actually. So that's crazy. Oh, uh, really? Nice. I definitely so know, know the answer to this one. Man, we should have been picking these if you're such a Pokemon buff. Apparently, I didn't think I was. Apparently, I was. <laughs> the only I tried person. to go with like ones that I'm pretty sure most people would know if they have any connection to Pokemon at all whatsoever. Too so. bold. I genuinely am shocked no one else knows these. <laughs> I thought they were pretty good. Story every day and two extra on the weekends. I'd have told you. I got it. I, I wait. And I got it too. Is, I, is that I, what it's I, called though? And I got I, it too. I know yeah. what the answer is alluding to. I just don't know if the Pokemon's literally called that. What could it be? Yee, do you have any ideas? My mind is blank. I'm just going through a bunch of Pokemon <laughs> names, and they're not working. I'll I'm spitball you. You know, pass it back and forth. See what you guys come up with. I was going to say Mol Moltray stories, but that doesn't work. <laughs> What's the timer on this? I, I, got a, a I got a mental count. Yeah. Um, Basically until I'm bored. <laughs> Kangas, come oh, on. You don't get no. bored easily. Yeah. Oh, yeah, uh, no, definitely not me. Ten seconds. Please, 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 please. A little longer, a little longer. <laughs> Start spitballing. Mm, I've told you, Mew. Holy shit. Don't. Five. Four. Wait, 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 wait. Three. Two. One. Typhlosion. <laughs> Come on. Here we go. Come on, I get to steal news that. That's been on about I get to recently. steal that, right? I didn't, I didn't even know the Pokemon and the prompt gave me the clues. Enough. All right, what? I'll allow you guys to steal. Nine tails. Nine tails. Yes. It is in no! fact nine tails. I told you a story every day and two extra on the weekends. I'd have told you nine tails. Oh, because there's seven days. Oh, you didn't even do the math on how many it would be. I didn't even. I didn't even. I was just thinking about like numbers and you know maybe it's better to uh, see sto Storymon, story chew. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Weak Dayamon? I don't get it. I don't dude, know. I even went down like, Digimon? Where, dude, I went so deep into story. I was like, what are people with his, with story names? And then I thought of Historia. No, that's Attack on Titan. No. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Two swordsmen complimenting each other as they fight to the bloody end. Hmm. That's a sharp tip that you have there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my ribs are so fractured. Yes, yeah, so you've penetrated my jugular. It's it's <laughs> impressive that I'm still able to stand here wielding this object. What will be your next move? Hmm. Maybe a little back shots, a little back a little... stabbing. Now that is something that I cannot say that I've ever dealt with in a duel such as Would this. Would you like to try? I am bleeding and it will die in twenty minutes. But oh wow! Shots. So you have the endurance as well. I can probably only last here for eight minutes with your back shots. Okay, enough, nice enough. Game. This is not even sword's play anymore. Get out of here. This, this is sword play. This is sword this is, play. This is sword foreplay. <laughs> They're sword fighting. All right, good, good enough. You don't lose any points. You don't lose <laughs> swords. I was thinking Princess Bride, if you guys have ever seen that. So I was that thinking was, that too, yeah. Bad. Do See, we these, not, guys, these guys are getting it. I like it. Do we not get a point if we steal? Is it simply like an honor? No, thing? because it's at the last second thing. they yelled Typhlosion, so we don't get to steal. <laughs> oh, right, right. That makes sense. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Good job. We're so in there. Last, last, minute, last minute block of that steal, so good stuff. So <laughs> no one's ever going to steal anything. Got it. So it's, this stealing is not a mechanic at all. <laughs> <laughs> it could be. You never know. If I laugh hard <laughs> enough or it's, it, if I feel like it, you know. Uh, you'll, you you're never know. Laugh you never know. Answer. The <laughs> rules are a little more fluid answer? than I really make them out I to be. I told you a story. Every Who day wants to be a millionaire weekend. with the rule of cool? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Piss off so many people. <laughs> All right, Funk Lazy, what do you guys want? Mm. I almost want to go for 500 Pokemon, but that's a lot to risk. Right, let's do it. Let's do, let's do it. We, You're on fire. You're on fire. 
for 500? Okay, we're doing 500 they've lost Pokemon. You, they've lost. All right. Who's that Pokemon for 500? The slogan for a bee running for president. Well, oh, come on. I know it. I already, is, know, I already is, know it. But does bee drill not make sense? Lazy, I know it. Okay. Well, yeah, I, I know it too. Well, okay, too. all right. All right. Hold on. I'm going to get up and do a spin before I... <laughs> He's going to spin. Electabuzz. Oh, wow. wow. Amazing. Yes, 100%. Oh it's elect a buzz. So well smart. done. <laughs> my God. Very impressive. Very impressive. The neurons man. are firing. This guy gets it, man. Where's the idea that we'd get stuck on B drill? Uh, yeah, that was actually the idea. That's why I thought it would be a good 500. You go with the B Pokemon. But no, it's elect a buzz. Good That's job. Great. Well done. All right. Quick 500 for you guys. All right. A basketball player in an interview with a reporter that keeps asking oddly personal questions. You know, it was a solid game, not much to say. I just, we're just, you know, we put in the work. We put in the work. No shame for the other team. You know, we put in the work. Hey, you got something in your teeth. Oh, I do? Uh, yeah. Uh, do you ever, did, do you ever did I get it? just take, do you ever take the, did the I get ball it? home and just sit on the couch with it and like watch a movie? Did, did I get it? Yeah, yeah, you got it. Okay, so what about balls? So do you ever, do you ever like take lipstick and just, uh, you know, make like a semblance of, of lips on the ball and then watch a movie with it and kiss it. Are you new? This is the NBA. That's that's day one hazing. Is it? No, I'm You're, being serious. You, I'm being serious. Are you new? How sweaty do you get on the field? Okay. All right. One of these guys. Where do they find these guys? Um, yeah, I sweat. <laughs> <laughs> You look sweaty. Uh, can I can I have you? What? Uh, I got my headphones in. Sorry. Uh, I'm listening. And, and so, do you think you could have denied the three pointer if you had positioned more uh, towards left court at the half? Point? Yes, finally. Yes, yes. I, I, that is, I, yeah. I caught that in the moment. It felt bad. I'm glad my team put me on their back. Uh, yes. If you had you. to fight like a horse-sized duck, or a duck-sized horse, <laughs> um, which, which would which would you fight? I, I would fight a single duck-sized horse. <laughs> yes, I would. Yes. You, okay. You sure so you got I that actually one right? brought I actually brought a duck-sized horse with me. Uh huh. He's, he's right there. <laughs> Can it play ball? And I was just wondering if you would fight to the death with him. Yeah, on the court. For our if, it, if it can play ball, I'm always I'm always down. It can play ball. It can play ball. All right, let's see it. Chucko, get out there. Ah! Oh, my God. Good it's enough. disgusting. All right, good enough. <laughs> <laughs> it's disgusting on the court. <laughs> it's just a dribbling. Oh, my God, the movement. <laughs> the size of a horse and the mobility of a rat. Incredible. Right, the, bat, the player was handling, like, the haze sh shots too well, so I had to pivot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, that was pretty good in my book. So, uh, yeah, you guys get the points twice. Which one would you like now? How about you pick? I got my five hundo. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right, uh, sure. Uh, yeah, gonna... No, 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 no <laughs> sorry, sorry. I've blinked out. Let's see. Uh, you know what? Oh, do I want to risk it all on the monsters? I feel like that's I feel like that's radioactive. You don't want to touch that column. Let's try rock, paper, scissors again, 300. All right, rock, paper, scissors for 300. Hawk, Hawk eats catches a mouse. a mouse. Mouse, I I guess. I still think it's throw. <laughs> My gosh. <laughs> mouse <laughs> beats throw. <laughs> you can't catch him. Uh, but you could catch the bird. That's that's what you're saying. Yeah. Easily, easily. Mm -hmm, okay, cheese mm -hmm. does not beat Hawk, what right? Beats, what beats Hawk? Cheese? No. I don't think, like, I... It, maybe it's something they digest and that, like they can't digest. Is this again that like mouse beats person because they spread plague or something and people shoot hawks and they're <laughs> endangered? Knowing Tubold, it's probably man again. <laughs> it's not man. I'll give you that. Oh, okay. seriously? Okay, okay. Yeah, it's not man. <laughs> that what would have been my beat? legitimate. What we need to figure out is what mouse beats. Like, first and foremost, that needs to make sense. Well, I will mouse... say this is another funny question. It's hilarious, uh... honestly. Man, cat? No, cause mouse, cause cat beats mouse. No, no. Makes sense. Does mouse beat anything? 
Not me. Cheese. It only beats cheese. I oh uh, yeah, Ina inanimate objects. It has a one hundred. You know what I think? On them. I think Tubold is operating on Tom and Jerry logic, <laughs> and the answer actually <laughs> is cat for some f reason. Wait a minute. That. I will say that would be convince. that would be neutral. That would be neutral. What do you mean? Okay. If I was operating they, on Tom and Jerry logic, mouse beating cat wouldn't be a thing. It'd be neutral. Uh, okay. All okay. right. It's a skill matchup. Wow, we have a. I'm seriously real blanking Jerry truther. on what mouse beats, <laughs> so I can't feel confident in anything. It would only be like house, like have, you know, because mouse is right, 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 getting right. the walls, or but it's then, wall, like what wall. Kind of I bet it's wall. Oh my god! Like mouse can get through a wall, but a hawk flies into a wall and dies. <laughs> Everything you say makes sense, man. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and I still don't think any of them are what two holes chose. That's the problem. <laughs> Like wall. I can debate any answer to make sense, and it's not going to be the answer. Mouse eats. Is there anything else that a mouse eats that affects a hawk? A bigger hawk? No, that one. Mouse make sense. beats gun because it can dodge and then jam the mechanism. <laughs> you can Fascinating. dodge, unlike unlike a hawk, which cannot dodge. <laughs> no, they're, they're just up there. <laughs> There's no cover in this I guy. Can't, it I, makes perfect sense. No pun intended. I can't pull the trigger. Fuck. Water, maybe? Because, like, rats don't really drown, do they? They tend to sort of just float. But a hawk. Uh, what beats a hawk other than gun and the gun? The hawk to us. <laughs> the hawk to us. No, God. <laughs> I legitimately, wall is the only answer wall I can feels... think of. And I don't think Tubal thought of that hard about it. I Mouse not. doesn't be glass, right? Because hot, like birds fly into I don't glass. See... There's no, I don't see why sense. I would. <laughs> no. But mouses don't historically break glass. Okay, wall. I think we go with cheese and just see if it's a curveball. But what, how would cheese be hawk? How? It's a. It's quite the thinker. It's quite the I, thinker. I'm saying wall. I, I think Tubold you, you will tell that. us how cheese. I'm sure Tubold will tell us how cheese <laughs> be talk in about five seconds. Our final answer is cheese. Okay. All that's, right. The that's final confidence. answer is cheese. It's actually elephant. Uh, oh, mouse beats oh, elephant. Wait. Oh my god! You're elephant right. Elephant throws rock at hawk. So that's. Do they uh, actually? Kind of opposable trunk. Yeah. Mice actually, for some <laughs> godforsaken reason, terrify they, they elephants, scare elephants, which is yeah. the funniest that thing ever. That makes sense. Oh, this is real life logic. Okay, yeah. I mean, half uh, of that makes sense. Yeah, exactly. And then the hawk can't do anything to the elephant because it's a hawk, so the elephant can just throw a rock at it. So, yeah, there you Man, go. Good Easy peasy. Very straightforward. <laughs> anyway, two kids arguing over whose dad could beat up the other's dad. My dad's like seven feet four. <laughs> You said you. Oh, sorry. I was. I was looking. I, I was looking up elephants. <laughs> um, my dad, <laughs> my dad is can beat Superman. Up that elephant. <laughs> my dad is Superman and Batman. My dad could shoot Batman and Superman. Bat, bat, <laughs> Batman makes the gun go away because he doesn't like him. <laughs> my dad can beat anyone. He. I don't want to make that joke. Oh my God! Is everything okay, Timmy? At home. <laughs> my dad w wins every argument. He's won every argument with my mom, and we don't even talk oh anymore. God. That's how much he won. Oh my God! I'm s your dad. Honestly, sounds kind of scary. I'm gonna keep. Uh, yes. I'm gonna tell my dad to stay away from your dad. My teacher gave me a phone number to call, but I'm too scared to call it. Okay, yeah. enough. Oh, jeez, <laughs> Rick. Oh, jeez, Rick. Jeez, <laughs> Rick. I can't do it anymore. All right, well done. No, no points lost Thank there. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, God. Uh, all right. Uh... Uh, fish, you, you're, you're up. Fish, our Pokemon one is gone. We're doomed. Um, we're, we've already lost. What if we were all boys and uh, we went down the girlfriend monster path? Because we, we have an advantage. We know. Ooh, we know Camille. Camille. The, yeah, yeah, yeah. We know Camille over, yeah, let's do that. over let's these, do that. these buffoons. Okay. So what if we skip 200? We went to 300. Just keep it Ooh, safe. Okay, you know? okay. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Uh, we will be taking 300. All right. Well, my girlfriend calls these monsters for 300. <laughs> so that has to be good luck, bitch. Oh, he's beautiful. Clifford, the big red dog, right? Bitch. Um, oh, bitch. No, no. Asshole. <laughs> Do you I know Camille? Think... Do you yes. actually know her? Have you ever yes. talked to her? Yee? Shitter. Uh, she does speak like that sometimes. 
Oh my god, this guy's a bitch. Like she yeah, 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 yeah. She does that. Um, it's a nickname. But this is Monster Hunter. Wait, you said she's been playing it with you? Yeah. Yeah, oh that's god, pretty she valid. The VCs, no. Um. Hmm. I will Lizard? say there are two options here. One of Red them is not Lizard. written down. The other one is the the normal one. But she said the other one frequently. So if you can guess the hidden one, uh, I'll give it to you. But for the most part. What does my girlfriend call this month? Can I use so call a friend? One, you want to use call design. a friend? Yeah, can you know I call if, Camille? Yeah, call, call a friend. Can call I call a friend. Go, you know, go ahead. <laughs> no, no, no. Integrity, okay. Is this legal? Um, <laughs> if it's funny enough, I'll allow it. <laughs> ooh, ooh. You might be the only person in the history of Jeopardy to try and call a friend. <laughs> <laughs> On my next guess, I'm going to like... Google the answer while I honk a clown nose and just see if I can get away with it. <laughs> Ten seconds. What if we just locked in dog? It's it, it's like a... <laughs> lizard, it it dog? looks more like a dog than a lizard, in my opinion. Ooh, dragon? Let's say red dog. Um, kill the dog. Yeah, fine. Let's go with kill dog. Kill the dog. Yeah, yeah. Shoot the dog. We're locking in yeah, dog. Angry dog. Yes! Oh, yeah, yes! you got it. Yes! It's angry dog. Yes! <laughs> well done. So angry bad. dog. Believe it or not, the other answer was Kaito, since you guys know the name of my actual thinking, yeah, dog. But she, Kaito, says, but she says, no, it's Kaito. I would never I'm like, think, this like, is like, not let's... Kaito. Look at this creature. It's a giant red monster. I'm assuming you're killing it in Monster Hunter. You're yeah. hunting it. So I yeah. wouldn't say she would want to hunt Kaito. Yeah, so this is actually the, her most hunted monster, believe it or not. Okay. The, the crim, Crimson Cane Corso, I believe. Mm, there you go. Uh, where's my prompt? Hello? Oh, well. Uh, Your prompt you have is to, to make a prompt. a prompt. Yeah. Yep. All right. Think of a prompt. Go. I'm hunting my dog. <laughs> um, mm. I'm, I'm searching for it. It has betrayed me. It ate someone else's food instead of the food that I provided it ye. Where do you think Kaito went? Hey, man. What are you going to do with the dog? Are you going to shoot it down? Um, uh, uh, just, just look at the flowers, ye. Just look at the, look at the pretty flowers. I'm are a representative from PETA. Would you PETA? want to be hunted down by an animal, I'm, by I'm a not, disgusting human? I'm not hunting down my dog. I was simply searching for it. Where um, do you draw the line? I, 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 I was, hunt a cat? My, my dog is lost and I love it very much and I was searching for it and I was planning on continuing to live a happy, healthy lifestyle with it after. You have a shotgun. This, this is, shotgun. Uh, this is a lawn mower. <laughs> I, was, I was lawning, I was mowing my lawn. Your grass hasn't been cut for two weeks. And that is a shotgun. Now, where right, do you draw enough. the line? Good enough. Good enough. For not having a prompt. prompt it's a pretty good prompt. I don't know. I honestly don't. I looked at it earlier. This might have been one of the drafts. I don't know what happened to it. But, uh, How do you, you know what? from, I'm going to shoot my dog, to, I'm just looking for him. I lost him. <laughs> I am a member of PETA. I was PETA. speaking to PETA. <laughs> this is a lawnmower. <laughs> it's like a four-year-old trying to lie. <laughs> All right, well, you got it right, and you got the prompt, so bonus points to you. What category would you like next? Hmm. Hmm. Should we try? Do you want to do something we haven't done? Wait, can't we not do the Shadow Realm, or what? You oh, you want to try Rock, Paper, Scissors or something? What yeah, is the trigger for the Shadow Realm again? I think saying your phrase shadow is going to be tough. I think yeah, Rock, Paper, Shadow Realm is... Yeah, 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 rock, Paper, Scissors, prompts. 400. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rock, Paper, Scissors for 400? All right. Yep. Yeah. Ronald beats Wendy. Wendy beats what? What beats Ronald? That's probably like the Burger King mascot, right? Like the Burger King, right? Hmm. What if it's not imagine. that simple? It's always those three. <laughs> I'd like to steal. No, no, he wouldn't. No, he wouldn't. I'd like to steal that comment that you just made from you. Uh, okay. Let's get back on track. I think... Hmm. Ronald, Wendy. Did you draw these? I did, in fact, draw these in MS Paint, yes. That's impressive. Nice. That's Thank impressive. You. Now, the question is, could he draw like, the Burger King? Is the yeah. Burger King simple to draw? I personally think it's a bit sexist that you drew Ronald's legs and not Wendy's, but um, we'll move this on. Is, this I think... is the only prompt. You just lost the goodwill that you got from the initial comment, so <laughs> now you're in a state of neutral. So go on. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he silences feminists. Um, uh, I, think, 
<laughs> you have to give if us it makes you <laughs> if it makes you feel better he didn't draw fingers on either of them that's oh that's true, true. okay oh, man. what if it's like hmm. i think you also notice that wendy has more detailed hair so watch yourself there buddy what is <laughs> that's true yeah okay i'll give you that um there's more what other mascots are there for fast food there's oh, sonic kfc the hedgehog yeah, but what is it? I feel like people don't really use uh, McDonald's, Wendy's, and KFC. It's McDonald's, Wendy's, and Burger King. Jack in the Box. Got that big snowball, snowman guy. Yeah, but again, like, I think. What does Ronald's even beat Wendy's in? We have to think oh, about that. Oh, what if it's about food? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, it's the yeah. actual menu. So, what yeah, does Wendy's man. beat? Wendy's does Wendy's beat Taco Bell in anything? What what does McDonald's beat Wendy's in? No, but it's not it's not calling it the store. It's calling them by their mascot names. That's so true. why would it be like Ronald mm. Wendy Taco Bell Ronald? Mm. That would yeah that does make sense. Yeah, mm. I think. Mm. Thank you for that. Um, I think. I mean, I mean, no, you <laughs> should you should forfeit that entire train of thought and focus on whatever else. I think, I think yeah. What if we locked into Burger King? Right, ye, right? <gasps> yeah, 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 yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. I, I think it, it it's the burger. Sense. It's the so it's lost. the Burger King. That's our final answer. All right, they go with Burger King. Lazy, Funk. What did you guys want to say? Uh, a nice home cooked meal. Uh, no, it was uh, it was actually uh, Colonel Sanders. <laughs> <laughs> Colonel Sanders. <laughs> Could you explain? Nobody ever talks about KFC with those three. Could you explain so, the internal logic? So, mostly for this one is just the fact that uh, I wanted to draw Colonel Sanders as well. But uh, <laughs> the idea was I've Colonel seen Sanders? I've seen pictures of Ronald and Colonel Sanders having like anime battles when they're with two people oh, cosplaying yeah. them, which always made me laugh. And then I remembered that Wendy's uh, roasted the shit I think out of KFC at some point, and I thought mm-hmm. that was pretty funny on Twitter. So I figured that was the kind of idea going on there. So I remember Wendy's roasted someone, but either way, for the for this prompt, he did was, the uh, research. Well, yeah, I, I, I remember vaguely stuff, and uh, I looked up the cosplay battle anyway, which was pretty fun because Colonel Sanders so walking around with like a Buster sword, and Ronald was carrying a normal like Sephiroth sword, I think. Yeah, it's so, just, this is essential it, reading, guys. I was gonna say yeah. it's just my fault yeah. for not reading enough books. Like, yeah, uh, yeah. I'm just. <laughs> Yeah, wrong there's, with me. there's critical lore you guys are missing about uh, Internet 101, so that's, it's not on you, but you know it is it is a loss there. But uh, yeah, anyway, the prompt. BK was a red herring. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I like the I like the train of logic though. It was pretty pretty fun to listen to. Someone trying to order in a drive thru and the cashier just can't hear them. Uh, hello, is is anyone there? What? Oh, I I, I just wanted to order my four for four. Here. Huh? Um, oh, sorry. I, wait, I realized it's the wrong restaurant. Um, yeah, can I get the Krabby Patty, please? Speak up. I'm I'm speaking. Pre- oh, is is your intercom not working here? Let me roll down my window more and reach my head out. Uh, yeah, let me get the Krabby Patty. I know it's a it's a new deal you guys got going on. Is, huh? is, is, I- <laughs> <laughs> should I just get, should I just park my car and come in through the front door? I just didn't want to. No, get no, out no, of no. My... Stay there, stay there, stay there. Right, say that uh, again. You heard that perfectly. <laughs> yeah, let what? me get a yeah. Let me get a uh, a crabby patty. I can't hear you. You. Let me. I, I I really don't know what I'm supposed to hear. I'm I'm scre- I'm stepping out of my car. I'm now outside no, no, of my door. There, I'm, no, 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 no. It's fine. It's fine. I'm I'm outside of my car already. No, no, right, go back, go back, go back right now. So you knew that I said that I was getting out no of my car. No car, no service. <laughs> go back. Go back in there right now. Right Give now. me a Krabby Patty. What? <laughs> All right. Good enough. That was so good. <laughs> oh, you, you were born for this role. We're going to stop the auditions. <laughs> yeah. You, what? I, no, no. Look at right into it. Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> That's just me. I was just playing myself. All right. Lazy <laughs> Funk. Let's just see. We have here. a pretty comfortable lead here. Oh, you want to go Wait small? I'm thinking two or three hundred. I... I don't really see. I feel like it's too big of a risk to go for four hundred comment section. Saying or phrases seems I'm, pretty guessable. I'm good with sayings. Yep, three hundred sayings. But well, hold on, because okay. we we've gotten the last two wrong, haven't we? Um, 
there was only one on sayings that we really got wrong. Yeah. I want to try 300 on saying or phrases. I feel like, okay. you know, the power right. of threes. Sayings or phrases for 300. If a frog had wings, he wouldn't bump his ass hopping. If a frog <laughs> had wings, he wouldn't bump his ass hopping. So, can I... I feel like this is a fair clarifying question. Is this saying sure. in reference to a person, or is it just saying if frogs had wings, they wouldn't bump their ass? Like, I'm just asking, Is this? are these sayings in reference to talking about somebody? Wrong. Yes, they are things that you would say in conversation with someone. Uh, well, no, but about someone. Or is this just... Is it is it about someone? I would someone? say it's... It could be about someone or yourself. I would say in this case, it would be about yourself. Bump his ass confuses me. Because a it's frog a, doesn't bump his ass he, when he doesn't have wings. This is all what in the third person. What does that mean? This is a third person sentence. So I'm just like, he must only be talking about a frog. There's like three levels of, <laughs> of It would start as, on this. well, if a frog had wings, he wouldn't bump his ass hopping. How about that? You know, weirdly, the southern accent helps me process it <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same if a well. frog had wings, he wouldn't bump his ass hopping. Yeah, that's pretty much exactly how you would say the sentence, too. Oh, oh, I think oh, it's, oh I think you it's... know what it is? It's in response to someone saying, uh, like, if only I didn't peek that corner, we would have won the fight. Like, uh, if only <laughs> Yeah, I... yeah, it's... it's... <laughs> It's yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. well, if the world were perfect, no one would ever, you know, no, yeah, lose no, a tooth. This is, an analog, kind of this is an analog to like, yeah, and if if, uh, if my I name was Steve, I'd be in Nerfic. Minecraft, you know? Like, it's one of those. <laughs> I think so, too. Yeah. How do we phrase that? I think it's a, like... It's a snarky it's like response a, to if, if statements. It, it's a disregard. It's like a disregard for the theoretical. It's like, yeah, it, maybe... So, you know, maybe if that were true, but it's not. Is that your final answer? Yeah. All right. Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. Not care about your excuses or unrealistic wishes, but that's yes. pretty much exactly what it would be used for. So, yeah, well Perfect. done. Perfect. You got but it. The southern accent is what made it clear. <laughs> <laughs> All sayings are southern. Every single one of these is, in fact, a southern accent, except the first one, which I just made up because I thought it was funny. Fair. Uh, I'm going to get all of them now. All right. That sounds good to me, but uh, yeah, yeah, good job. Got the points there. Uh, your prompt, time traveler, convincing his past self not to get that one tattoo. Mm, f funk, you want to think of the tattoo before the... Yeah. I'm blanking. Give it, Give me a moment to, uh, you know, walk backstage and then walk back out. Okay. Hey, you! Ah! You! Oh my god, who get are off you? The phone! What a freak! Stop! Hold up, my bandage is falling. Listen! You need to listen carefully to me. Ow. Yeah, okay. Okay? Ow, oh, yeah. Don't do it. Why? You, you little f asshole. Ow, why do you look like that? Well, uh, oh, my God. Why? Who are you, first of all? Because I have stabbed me in bold text in the middle of my chest. <laughs> are you saying Don't. people end up stabbing us after getting the tattoo that says stab me? You'd be surprised. I thought it was going to be like a really funny joke at parties, but apparently a lot of party goers tend to bring weapons with them. And you didn't, you didn't, we didn't, that self-defense course, it didn't help at all? No, no, now here's but the thing. I'm not actually, no, no, the wrist. <sighs> it's opening again. I'm not actually here to tell you to not get it. I just think we need to get it on a better spot because it doesn't look that good on our chest. I've always regretted not getting it on my arm. Oh, well, it's got to be think, somewhere where, like, the stabs accentuate it, right? Like, that's where you would want exactly. some badass scars. I, because I want, like, one of those tribal tattoos around my arm, but with stabs. And I always regretted that Dude, after the day I got it. that's so, sick. So, right here on my arm, I need it. And maybe in cursive, say, say oh. stab me repeatedly. I think we should add repeatedly, repeatedly. to it. Repeatedly, yeah. Then, then you can really get, like, a pattern going. And you can, we, okay, I'll move my arm, like, in ways that, like, it makes a pattern. What, what pattern should I do? I think you should, like, jump so it makes sort of, like, a chain link pattern. Okay, okay. that's good enough. <laughs> Stab me repeatedly. <laughs> it's like a Borderlands character that just says, shoot me yeah, in the yeah, head. Yeah, Do yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I like it. Well done. What else would you like? You got two more. Oh, yeah. We got another. Hmm. You know, 
I we have some leeway here. I think we go go for a four hundred. I'm. T I almost wanted because we know it's going to be southern sayings or phrases. I think four hundred for sayings. <coughs> That's okay. my my vote. Okay. I'm feeling confident for sayings. We're All doing right. four hundred saying. All right. You tell him, cabbage. You've got the head. Mm. You tell him, cabbage. You got the head. <laughs> That my, one doesn't help. My first <laughs> instinct is that like um, this is talking to a couple and one you know you know a couple that has a, a himbo and the brains of the operation, and it's like the the mom of the wife saying like you tell him cabbage you've got the head you know you've got the head on your yeah. shoulders. Like a shared brain cell, like you you've got the head of oh, cabbage. I, I see what you're going for there. Are you, I mean, it could be said in between a couple, too, where it's like, but that's that's weird. Could be like a... You tell him, Cabbage, oh. you've got the head. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I was thinking of it, but it could also be a backhanded compliment. Yeah, it also, I, that was also my first instinct. Or it that could be sarcastic. ironic. It's like, you got a head, but it's a head of cabbage. Mm. You tell him, Cabbage, you've got the head. I don't know. But what if, ca what if, what if Cabbage isn't a person and it's like... A noun. It's like you're telling them cabbage. <laughs> I you can. tell them cabbage, you've got the head. Like it, it's Wait. almost like you know if you're a snake salesman. Like if you're telling people cabbage, then you're ahead of it. Can we get like a spelling bee pronunciation too bold? You tell them cabbage, you've got the head. I I think that, it's that, it's that about, feels like a person. Yeah, I think that it's like an endearing acknowledgement that one person in the relationship is smarter than the other. And so they do the talking. I think so too. Yeah, I think I think it's uh, words of support, or like someone in a duo. Yeah. All right. Final answer. Mm -hmm. Seconded. All right. Yeah, it's to encourage someone. Who's right? You tell him, Gavin. Yeah. You've got the head. First of all, I think we've lost. I think we've lost. <laughs> we've lost. <laughs> We're doomed. You never know. You never Woo. know. But either way, you're prompt. A cat talking to a rat. This conversation will change the way they look at the world. Uh, hey, cat. It's me, rat. <laughs> oh my god that changes the way i look at the world <laughs> i just find everything funny now you've really opened up my my positivity i can't stop laughing <laughs> oh my god you're killing me I don't know which one of you is which. Are you making cat sounds I'm or rat. rat sounds? I'm rat. <laughs> I'm rat. rat, and my perspective has been altered. Ah, I see. All right, I'm not, I'm not giving <laughs> points for that. Oh, there's my therapy cat. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> then a guy walks away with a cat. All right, you're not getting points for that. <laughs> <laughs> I'd say we stuck to the prompt very I think, I think Bug's mic just wasn't working as he was making the noise because they were so high pitched. <laughs> right. well, I, I honestly thought I was the rat at first, and then I had to pivot. <laughs> I said, Hi, cat, I'm rat. How could I? They both sound not? the same, okay? <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> All right, either way, that's fine. You guys are pretty far ahead anyway. I don't think you'll miss the bonus points. Yeah, right. he said right. they won. He said they won. <laughs> you get, you do get to pick the, the next one. the big points. So good. Oh, we're still going. We right. need to get a 500 E. <laughs> Listen, uh, I'm going to be honest with you, it is still anyone's game. It is, it is. 400 Go comments? Yee, I think the comment section for. Oh, wait, isn't it? Wait, who is it? Did we do three in a row yet, or do we still I have forget. This will be your know. last one. Okay, okay, last okay one. my bad, my bad. 400 comments? Yep. All right, 400 for comment section. Okay. Bro started from the bottom and crouched. This comment is about to ratio the f video. I can't. Mm, so definitely someone hated. <laughs> someone who was... Mm, someone, oh, come on. I mean, I'm thinking like <laughs> Nick Akato, <laughs> but before... <laughs> that's, uh, that's like a Persona avatar, so it's, it must be like video game. Like, it must be nerd culture stuff. Who would who would start from the bottom and never climb up but still have this much attention? Bro started from the bottom and crouched. Again, that could be a million videos that does not that, fight like any like anyone conflict. hateable, right? Like That's it could I'm be to... sure. It could be like you know a, an influencer put out a song. Oh, it is like it is the fire emoji. It, 
That's what these yeah, kind of comments it, are usually oh, on. Okay, the question a, is, what would it be on? I, I think I think we can be this vague. It's a YouTuber trying to drop their their um their music career on YouTube, but it's trash. Like perhaps the KSI song that everyone's dumping Maybe, on. Maybe, but two days I feel ago, like edited. too bold. I feel like Too Bold would pull something more niche out, almost like an ironically bad rap song or something. But, but it's, it's, ratioing, no, no, it's, it's ratioing the video, so if people must unironically not like the video. That's true. If it's getting ratioed, then yeah, I think it's, it, it's I think probably it's genuine. A YouTuber trying to force their uh, music career and getting dunked on. That seems like the safest guess because we have nothing else to work off of. Yeah, I I support that. It's a uh, in influencer making a song that is so correct it's ksi's video no, well yeah, absolutely uh, fantastic we yep. had it you were dead i just i just one. we could have gotten that the shit. only reason oh. that this one is this far up is because this one is referencing something that happened so early and there's basically no context in the actual comment itself you just either had to know it or not ah. but you your train of logic was literally perfect so congratulations Hurrah. on that one fantastic <laughs> Have you heard no, the 1950s or whatever version of this song? Because it's ironically no. so much better. It's actually Dude, I haven't really, even heard really this good. song. I've only heard it's, snippets. It's pretty bad. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's it's pretty mm -hmm. bad. For the stars. So I've I heard. guess this is how the story this goes. Is how the story <laughs> goes. Whoa. Yeah, and that will not get a random feature on this video, so KSI I can't copyright my shit. Anyway, two dudes catching up while one keeps bringing up continually more major events he was a part of. Oh, hey, bro. It's been forever. You're, Tony, uh... man. Oh, I missed you. Yeah, it's been so nice. You're, that, you're him. You're him, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. I just wish I could have gotten more people out of there, you know? Uh... But, but that's neither here or there. I've actually been... Um, like, what have you been up to? I've been cooking more. Well, I mean, I... I think I've only, you know, not, you know, major events, not me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've not been doing anything, yeah, bro. Nothing that's... but minor events. Um, uh, that's yeah, me, bro. I that's actually, my actually, my hands have been pretty tired since uh, all of the world's chefs mysteriously died of poisoning. And, you know, I was the one chef left. So I've been pretty busy. Uh, you you, you tell me, you, you made my burger? You put the fries yeah. in the bag? You? But Yeah, that's actually we're that's why I'm currently cooking while we're talking. It's like nonstop work. You're cooking for the entire world population. Yeah. No joke. And the weirdest part Yeah, yeah, and the craziest part is um, you know, all of the cows uh in in the world uh went sterile. So I I had to go uh out in, into this like this field out out in the the Mediterranean just to find the last <laughs> A non state like the last fertile cow so that we could oh. keep making burgers oh oh i'm glad that's how you solved that problem um but <laughs> but enough about that i've been reading fellowship of the ring have you read that book it's so good yeah i didn't write it i did not write it i wouldn't I, think I, you I, did. I didn't make a movie about it like i had nothing to do with that shit man uh, well <laughs> i know that i think i know that <laughs> tolkien is my great-grandfather oh wow. he let he only left me his his entire estate Wow, man, that's sweet of him. That's really sweet of him. So, so do you like it medium well? Oh yeah, yeah, that's fine, man. Whatever's I, I know you got a lot on your plate, and I'm about to have a lot on my plate. <laughs> Thanks, man. <laughs> Thanks. Or, yeah. <laughs> or if you want, I can make it a medium gotchen. You know, the new the new type of of, of okay. meat that I came up with. <laughs> All right, that's good enough. <laughs> came up with a new Invented kind of meat. A new meat. That is fun. <laughs> Every cow like, went sterile on the planet, I feel and like all I, the chefs died. <laughs> I feel like I swung too high out of the gate, and I just had to <laughs> somehow keep up with my own mouth. I, I, Continually I, more major events. Yeah, every chef is dead now, and I'm cooking for the world. Wow, I can't wait to see how he scales up from this one. <laughs> <laughs> it was all too right. big too fast. All right, so there you go. You are comfortably in the lead. Uh, yeah. That was your last, last one. But uh, fish and eat. Believe it or not. It's still anyone's game. Go ahead. <laughs> yeah, I think we, we know. have to go to the um, comment section. <laughs> the comment section. I'd say we knew the last yeah, one. Yeah, we we're gonna know this one. Yeah. Comment, comment section, section for five hundred. For 500. Thirteen I likes. Think, I used to think this movie was what? live action, and the people who lived in Europe looked like this. <laughs> <laughs> I think this movie was live action. <laughs> the people who li So maybe it's the Mario movie. 
But no, but no, Mario movie happens in New York. Um, yeah, um, yeah, that's the only problem with that, I guess. What if, what if, I used to think this movie was live action, that people who lived in Europe looked like this. Okay, I, I don't know how genuine they're being when they're saying, I used to think this movie was live action, and people who lived in Europe looked like this. Okay, so this is a recent comment. You can tell by the format. Of, it's not live action. It's animated or something. Yeah, it's it's an animated, I'm assuming like 3D, kind of like uh, the, the looks of Ready Player One when they're mm-hmm. when they're under the VR helmet. Um, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, I mean, some movies that are popping into my head is like the trailer of that one movie with Angelina Jolie, Beowulf, I think it's called, right? You remember that one? No, oh, that that's a good a one. I do know what he's talking about. That is, um, that is pretty good. What about good. that one movie mm. with the girl that has big ass eyes? Do you know what I mean? Big ass. Oh, uh, uh, Battle Angel. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Angel. What's her name? Kier. I, no I know it. Ke- what Ke- it's like Barbie movie or something stupid like that. No, because live action is like it needs to be an animated movie. Uh, uh, Akira, Akira, Battle Angel. I will give you a hint <laughs> because this one is pretty vague. You're on the right track. However, the movie was released in the early 2000s. What? Early 2000s. Oh, God. We're so cooked, dude. We're so cooked. Oh, God. <laughs> what do you um, define as early? Like, before 05? Like, I'd say, two, yeah, before 05. Yep. Something about Europe. What is... Ten seconds. Europe. Yeah. yeah. Let's lock, 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 lock in Beowulf. Lock in Beowulf. wrong. All right. <laughs> Beowulf. So it's Polar actually Express, uh, the Polar oh, Express. Oh, I know. It's the Polar God. Express. Yeah. So, uh, oh. I will say you guys were definitely on the right track. So I don't think I'm going to take away points, but you won't get to keep going. So what a banger! That was yeah. so difficult. Oh my god! You're on the right track. You're on the right track. I like the like the thought process going on there. But uh, yeah, your prompt is a child help helping their technology illiterate parent slash grandparent. Grandpa, <sighs> what is it this time? Well, I'm uh, I'm trying to write this email, but uh, this this ad keeps popping up. It tells me that milfs in my area, uh, there's there's milfs. What what is it? What is this milf? What, what is that? Um, we have grandma. So I, have, I, have, do that. Uh, I have grandma. I have grandma. Email right? But what, what is this milf that uh, I need to I need to know about it so that I can block the website? Please uh, help me. Uh, it's asking for just my name and my email. I, I, I can give that, oh, but I don't know. Let me help you. Let me help you. Y- yeah, oh, go for it. Naked. All right, I closed it. I closed it. All right, what do you help now with? Uh, you closed it. I, I mean, thank you, Timmy. Uh, uh, <laughs> well, I was, uh, <laughs> yeah, again, I was just trying to write this email, but again, oh, oh, it's another pop-up that I, I accidentally clicked on. Uh, uh, it, needs, it needs us to fill out this information because there's MILFs in my area, and, and, and uh, I don't know what a MILF is, so help me. <laughs> I, I need to fill out this information, but I don't know what my email is. All right, good. Why do you, why do you want to talk to MILFs? <laughs> All right, that's good. That's good. That's fine. <laughs> why do you want to talk to MILFs? <laughs> All right. I'll give you the points for the props. That's about it. All right, Lazy <laughs> Purple, area. you're Lazy Funk, you're up. Uh, and do 500 mm. rock paper. I mean, 500 I sayings. Feel like, I feel like we're so far ahead, we should knock out the big ones because then they don't get it. And if we lose it, we don't, like, we're still ahead. I mean, sure. There, there's not much left, right? Your That's pick what I'm between saying. rock, paper, and sigs. Uh, let's uh, let's do rock, paper, and okay. scissors. Okay. Let's get some variety. Yeah. All right. yeah. Adult. Ooh. Beats child. Child beats blank. Blank beats adult. Uh, well, I immediately think of the dumb Sphinx riddle where it's uh, an elderly person completing oh, the yeah, trifecta. I'm... I mean, uh-huh. an, an elderly is a chi- technically an adult. Yeah, I mean, so, like, an elder can tell an adult what to do, but a child kind of has that, like, dynamic where they tell an old person what to yeah. do, if the old person is nice, right? Like they have, mm. Yeah, like a healthy relationship, the child usually has influence. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And they can sway, you and know, like, like all, all the free food and money from grandma yeah, and Yeah, and they, they want to spoil the kid, right? Whereas, but then it's like, when they talk to their kid, it's like, what are you doing here? Hmm. So I'm... If it wasn't a, if it wasn't another stage of life, what would it be? Yeah, a hawk. <laughs> 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 Wait, no, that would be the other way. 
I can't think of anything you know, other than like another stage. Yeah, you'd have to be elderly try or really hard to think would, out of the box. Be elderly. Um, not many things that a child uh, like, has influence over that an adult doesn't. Hmm. Global warming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, global warming will kill the adults. You know the, the you know the young like the children got to go out and vote because the adults won't. That kind of thing. Damn. Damn, we put so much. Is, is there any political? Too bold. Is there any political commentary in this in this prompt? <laughs> uh, no. Okay, that we can eliminate global warming then. I just think you have to reach so hard to get away from an yeah. elderly person. Mm. I can't think of anything. Uh, nothing. I think we have to go with elderly. Yep. Okay. Lock it in. Final answer. We lock it in. Oh. All right. Final answer is elderly. It's actually uh, the draft. Uh, it's a believe it or not. It's the military draft. Oh, my God. The child how, can't be drafted, but oh. the draft beats the adult because the adult has oh. to be drafted, and then the adult can tell the child what to do. That's so, smart. So yeah. It's, yeah, it's a military I, draft. I won't push it on this one. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I, I see the vision. Yeah. <laughs> I see the comeback with this one. So yeah, that's uh, that's the end of that one. But your prompt is a waiter who keeps piling on orders and the chef desperately trying to keep up. <laughs> what do you want? Uh, I'll do I'll do waiter. Uh, we we got another order for twenty burgers and twenty fries. Another twenty? Oh my! Okay, give me a second. And coming I, I, in, we also need ten escargot and ten uh, black ink spaghetti. Okay, okay, I tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna. Start spitting on the empty plates, and I need you to send them back out. Hopefully, about thirty percent of them leave. That's gonna really even up my workload. Okay, all right, I'll uh, I'll give him the bill first. <laughs> be real, you start spitting. I'll give him the bill, and uh, I'll be back for all that spit. Okay, make sure you you spit on them too when you, you walk in. <laughs> I need them gone. All right, I think all right. you, I need after they pay the bill. Twenty I'll spit on burgers. Them. Most people get like six. All right, here, Tell those people. Here's your bill, sir. Thank you for uh, coming to We Spit on You Andes. Uh, <laughs> I'll be right back with the food. Oh, the, oh, this guy's getting a tip. Oh, thank you, sir. <laughs> all right, all right. They, they all have the one mega bill. Where's this bit? <laughs> I, I, I'm not moist enough. Get some water. <laughs> Drink it up. Drink it up. We need you. All right, good enough. Good enough. <laughs> not moist enough. <laughs> 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 all right not bad at all are right, you fish we want oh, God, we're f- we monsters would yes and we're gonna go all out with five hundo right <laughs> yes we are yes we are <laughs> it's the only way it's the only way no we can't play. i'm There's gonna no more i'm gonna it's ask safe you anymore. i'm gonna ask you are you sure we got played safe we got played we safe. have to we have no longer no, going no, no, to no, no, 500 400 400 yeah, yeah, 400, 400. All right, 400. What does my girlfriend Bird. call this animal? Uh, y- yeah, I mean... Dodo. I mean, no, I don't think she'd be that Turkey. specific. I, I think bird or chicken. I think we need to decide chicken, between those chicken. two. Mm. Yeah. Kaito? That could Get, also <laughs> <laughs> Get Kaito. Uh, I, I mean, I think it's either bird or chicken. It's very vague, it seems as though. She just calls the monsters by what their animal lookalike is. So, could also be Yasuo, you never know. It uh, it maybe could be. It is not Yasuo. For context, okay. Camille only plays Yasuo in League of Legends. She's quite obsessed. Okay. But it's not Yasuo. Um, Chicken, bird, turkey. I think we're going to go. I think we Hawk. just go with get the. I don't think she said get the bird. You'd be like, get the chicken. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's get the bird. Like, Can you get this chicken too, Christian? Get this bird chicken. boy. What if she adds like... Oh, wait, but it has an egg. What about yeah. Guy? Wait, wait, can you get this guy? <laughs> 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 Big calls. Ah, uh, yes, uh, the, the classic nickname for every single monster is get that guy. I think, what if we said Bird Boy? It seems though she adds boy to some of the, the titles. Does I she think. really? Yeah. I've never heard her say the word boy in my life. Okay, never mind, never mind. We'll just say, we'll just say bird, right? Oh, God. What, what if it is Kaito? Chicken's a type of bird, right? So you're covering your bases. Ooh, that's true. Yeah, I don't think, but bird is just easier to say. Get the, Try get being the... more specific than just bird. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. We're going to say <laughs> chicken. We're going to say chicken, yeah? Can you be more specific? Oh, uh, we're going to get the, the big chicken. 
<laughs> That's specific enough for you? The chicken, but big. Final answer? Get the uh, yellow chicken. Y- oh, y- wait. Orange chicken. Orange chicken. Oh, man. Yeah, I like... She's Taiwanese. Just oh, keep oh. throwing out <laughs> nouns and verbs until we get something. The big um, orange chicken over there. Yeah, get that big orange chicken. <laughs> you would not say get the orange get chicken. Get that sweet and sour chicken. <laughs> <laughs> I think we just say get the big chicken, right? We're locking that in, yeah? Do we have to be more specific? The okay. Big, big orange chicken. Big orange All right. chicken. Is that your final answer? <laughs> yes. That's not what All she right. says. No, it's a stupid chicken with your stupid <laughs> rock. <laughs> Where's the rock? Right there. Oh, I thought that was God. part of the body. Oh, my God. No. That's 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 it's egg. all in a rock. Stupid that chicken with your stupid rock. That too real. Do we get it's not acting. <laughs> Do we get a little bit? No, uh, I won't take points away. How about that? Okay, you got okay, 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 okay. How about that? And we get to go next. Yeah, yeah, you have to do the prompt too. Yeah. Um, Two um, guys after a ten loss streak and rank. This should be literally your life, just a normal conversation. <laughs> and we yeah. just go again. We just go again. It doesn't matter. We we weren't paying attention. Uh, I need that a game. Break. I, I, no, 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 no. Okay, trust me, trust me. Okay, okay. Now that we've lost ten times in a row. Blizzard will bless us with the W. They've realized it's hit the double digits. They would not allow for 50-50. I, I, I have 20 deaths every game. And that's fine. And that's fine. You, it's, we all have an off day. And now it's past midnight, so it counts as the next day. So, it's come on, queue up. turn off my computer. Up, just hit day. the ready up. Hit the ready up button, please. Please, please, please. I'm begging you. Bre- I, I think I'm going to do it. Break. All I ask. No, don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. But you can do it to the end. Take out your anger and your hatred on the enemy. Which no, we're I'm about to do fight. But, no, but you're don't feeding do all my games. Put it down. Put I should it down. Take it out on you, you asshole. Don't, you can take it out on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, uh, just yeah, go healer and shoot me and pretend that you're you're drawing <laughs> blood. Yeah, this is but, this is literally just the Discord call from a couple of nights still, ago. So. There's still one more elimination I know I can get. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, that's a great <laughs> Don't worry, I can secure this one. But Funk, think about it. What if you don't? <laughs> I think that would be even more demoralizing. <laughs> All right, that's a... Uh, 11 yeah, loss streak then. I'll really, give you points for that. Really proud of you guys. Else. No so teammate come blaming. Back. Come back. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Funk, Lazy, you're up. Uh, hmm. I still like sayings. Sayings is kind of a gimme. Yeah, yeah, no, we've been pretty good on these. Let's do 500 sayings. Look at that Wumpletog. All Wumple right, tog. man. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get a We both thought of the same thing instantly, right? <laughs> Can I get country of Unfortunately, origin? Unfortunately, getting the definition would give it away. So it's just it's a southern saying, look at that Wumpletog. Oh, I guess it would be, be more only along one. the lines of, I... like, it would probably be a lady saying it. So be, well, just look at that Wumpletog. Okay, when you say it like that, I think it's an endearing phrase for like a pet like look at my oogie boogie i think it's a a cock oh because <laughs> it's a, a woman saying it very very progressive funk just Anyone sort of the, can say the etymology of that word so. is very phallic to me in nature <laughs> but i could be wrong Wumple tog. The etymology of that word is phallic in nature i think that'd be a, a bit <laughs> wounding yes, put that on a t-shirt mm-hmm. oh look wumple at that wumple tog. Tog. I mean, it could be, yeah, it could be sort of like a cute pet name, you know, like, look at that little, that fatty wop, you know. <laughs> I, I will, I will give you a hint, it is not endearing. Mm. Okay, then I'm falling back on, on cock. <laughs> but I, I welcome second But it's opinions. not endearing, so what, is she dissing, she dissing the, the tool? Yeah, it's like, ugly hog, I guess. Not a fan. Look at that wumple tog. Man. Look at that wumple tog. And that'll leave a scar. You wouldn't call a person that. It doesn't convey any useful information. Mm. That wumple t- like I, I can't think of an object okay, that you would see and immediately think wumple tog other than It's not my endearing, statement. but it has an exclamation mark. So is it like... It doesn't... Mm. That Surprise. like takes away some sarcasm for, it's for me. It's more yeah. exasperated. Look at that wumple tog. Look like at a that really wumple tog. It could be like a fat animal, you know, just like you you going by a farm and you see yeah. a really fat, yeah, big chungus, really fat bison. This is or easily the hardest question on this entire board, <laughs> but 
if you were if you had any idea about southern sayings there's a good chance you might really really yeah. look at that wumple tog i mean I was i've think, uh, grown from... up in the south and i i don't i'm it made me think frog for some reason, south, but guess. it's probably just because it rhymes. Yeah, I could see a very frog kind of round creature. Wumple. <laughs> Tog. <laughs> Ten seconds. Let's break down the word wumple. <laughs> but, uh, you know, like uh, a, a, a crooked surface. I'm a just, very, like, let's just go with a chubby animal. Chubby animal. Let's go with that. All right. <laughs> it is not a chubby animal. It is said when someone has a beard, more specifically, but uh, oh. overall unkempt that was appearance. So difficult. Yeah. It's where, again. This is the hardest one. But where did you? Oh, you, hold on. You said if I was familiar with southern, like slang. Where does Wumpletog originate? I couldn't tell you that much. I just looked up really old sayings from the South, uh. and this was one of them. So. Oh, okay. So from 1832. <laughs> right. Yeah. How is it? It's uh, actually, I found it in Shakespeare. I don't know. Yeah. He said he was playing a Southern right. guy. Great so. granny should have told you. Yeah. But, uh, it's an unkempt beard or appearance. But uh, yeah. Uh, the devil and the angel on a guy's shoulder as he sees an old woman trying to cross the street. You should help her. Inch closer in the car. Stay slow. Stay so we don't whoa, want her to whoa, know. Oh, dude! Closer. Wait, no! Stop the car! Get out of the car! And Inch help closer. Her. Get within four. We want her to think we're gonna hit her, but we're not. But we want her to think that. So get a little closer. Okay, as long right, as we're not hurting her, it could be a little put funny. It in, put it in neutral. <laughs> put it in neutral. And now I need you to slam the gas. What? On but three, you didn't get your transmission checked. Two, one, slam it. Oh I'm slamming God. it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just, just, just donate to charity right, later. Stop. stop. Okay, now put it back. Now, donate look to away. Don't let right now. We're gonna gaslight her. Don't let her. She didn't even hear that. Pretend it didn't happen. Okay. I need, uh, uh, she turned to uh, us. Just do whatever okay, you want. Okay, this is psychological do warfare. Do whatever you want. Just, just <laughs> okay. <volunteer laughs> the, the angel's panicking. The angel's <laughs> having a heart attack. All right, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> He didn't even listen to the angel. Man. Put it in neutral <laughs> and rev that bitch. It could be funny. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's fine. No points there, but you don't lose any extra. So, uh, Good fish, enough. you're up. It's getting close. Whoop! Well, there's only two options. We will be getting 500 points. No, 200, right 200. Here. Let's do. Uh, we, you, if we get 200, we can then do 500. Okay. No. Those points. If you okay. lose it, though. Okay. Do what you want. Yeah, 200. Yeah, 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 yeah. 200. Come on, come on. Oh my god. Mm. Ooh, frog. Fat, fat frog. Fat yeah. Fat frog. Fat frog. Fat frog. <laughs> Get the belly frog. Uh, <laughs> fat frog. I don't like how quick and confident that answer um, is. Yeah, I'm thinking belly frog. Something fat, like that. B- fat belly frog. Fat, fat belly. Fat right. frog. Think think about, I will give you one hint. Think fat about lizard. the very first prompt. Fat lizard. Small fat lizard. <laughs> Get the small fat lizard. Get the fat lizard. It fat looks lizard? smaller. I don't know how big it is. It looks smaller. Oh. Get the fat lizard. Um. Balls lizard. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, the gonad. The, the fat lizard gonad. with the with the belly. Fat lizard with balls. Yeah, fat lizard with the balls. This time the ball is on his body. I hope we're both on the same page about that, right? All right, is that your final answer? Fat lizard with balls? Is that a rock? Wait, 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 wait. is that a rock? It's not no, no, a no, rock. It's not holding it. It's, it's his stomach. It's his stomach, neck, <laughs> chest, that, abdomen. No, that is its stomach. That is, in fact, its stomach. Okay, okay, fat wait. Lizard. Fat lizard. We're locking that in? It's big lizard. Yeah, that counts. Uh, we'll take fat lizard. We'll take fat lizard. That's the same problem. I think, yeah. It's lizard and then the big lizard. Incorrectly. Just listen to say 11 lost streak and it'll be like a sequel to the last Now I know. I know. I said after. You I said that we'd hit the double digit loss and it would be different. But trust me, our DPS had no idea what they were doing. Okay, let I didn't me play even know you DPS. Could go this below time. What is and, the and, 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 and you learn something new every day. And we're about to learn that after an eleven loss streak, it's impossible to lose. So fish, come I, on. Fish, I might Ready end up. it all. Please. You might end it I, all. I might end it all. You can't. You can't. Okay, and again, no anger one likes watching. The enemy. Everybody. <laughs> no one likes watching us. <laughs> they watch us for our personality. Fish, it GM, has to be that. We need to be GM gameplay. I know. Funk has no, gone offline. Oh, <laughs> Funk, one... no. Oh, no. Are you there, Funk? Hello? 
<laughs> I can't hear anything. He's not even muted. I th- what was that? <laughs> Wait, what, what happened? All right. Fuck. Good. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> right. He went offline, you. <laughs> I don't know how much more subtle he needs to be about it. <laughs> yeah, we are so back. We are so back. Oh my god, if we get this uh, unironically. <laughs> yeah, can 500 please not be big dog? <laughs> it's going to be big dog. It's about to be big dog. <laughs> Hit the 500. Nah, dog, nah, no, it's not big dog. What's this guy? Ooh, Kaito. Ooh, ooh, wait. This looks a lot more like Kaito than the last one. Um, it is not however, Kaito. It's, Oh, okay. oh, thanks for telling okay. them that. I was worried. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hmm. I, would I wouldn't have given anyone disgusting. the same like, thing. Uh, I've been giving you guys... I've been mean, all of you guys okay, hits. Okay, okay. Yeah. Besides, this Blue. is the most vague category out of all of them, and you guys don't know Camille, so... There honestly? You. Honestly? No, I think she said get the blue guy. Uh, <laughs> the, the, the blue... She wouldn't get say fox. Get the bird. It's not a bird. That's like a... That's it looks more fox. like a fox. Oh, wait, it has a beak. Yeah. It is. A, it is a bit of a bird. Are those wings? Yeah, those are wings. Okay, I thought it was just his like his spine, like that scoliosis spine. Uh, hmm. Scoliosis. Hmm. A bit of a bird. Hmm. So I think she takes the 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 color of the feathers into account. The blue. That is blue, right? A couple yeah. It's like it's a really <laughs> fancy name. Yeah. It's not looking. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Something blue. A blue. Blue Wumple Tog. <laughs> blue <laughs> Wumple Tog. <laughs> uh. Get the big blue bird. Get the. Get the. I, what if it's like just the blue boy? Oh, wait, wait. Think about the fourth one. <laughs> Think about the fourth one. What was the fourth one again? Stupid lizard with the stupid rock. Yeah, stupid but he's the, he doesn't have any rock or anything. He just, yeah, yeah. Get the blue. Could be like a bitch to face. Okay, get the get the stupid blue thing with the blue wings. Your girlfriend is a very reductive <laughs> name giver. She? <laughs> yeah, she, she really does. When well, she gets frustrated, she her creative nicknames are pretty straightforward. <laughs> The stupid blue guy with the dumb wings. Something like that, right? <laughs> Gonna name no, her kid we, we no Tiny choice, Baby. No choice. The blue guy with the dumb blue wings. All right, is that your final We're answer? locking in some, like, a, <laughs> the blue guy, dumb, stupid blue wings. Yeah, is that your final Mightest answer? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's actually Ice Chicken. Oh, <laughs> that is just the Ice Chicken. That's tough. Woo! That's tough. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, it's the it's the ice chicken. I would have given you points for uh, ice bird or blue chicken, something like that, if you had half of it. But uh, yeah, you had, you had nothing for that one. So uh, yeah, uh, a dad trying to give his son the talk, and the son is oblivious. You see, son, when a man and a woman, when a man and a woman love each other very much, uh, they just tend to spend time and activity and do activities together. Um, and they, they start to have the feelings attached towards one another. Are you, if, are you following? But I hate women. Um, well, you <laughs> see, the thing is about that, and sometimes it extends past that, uh, uh, little sport. So, uh, when you say you hate women, you, you mean you, you just maybe, uh, it, women aren't your type, right? Cause no, I've been watching a lot of Andrew Tate recently. And oh, oh, uh, <laughs> oh, God. Okay, I'll have to, I'll He's more of a father the... figure than you are, man. I oh, my God. You. I'll have to start watching the parental <laughs> guidance controls on the other TV and well, the I, YouTube. I huh? really hate women. Okay. Um, <laughs> and, uh, like, you know, I, your, I, mother, I would... your mother would not be happy to hear this, and you wouldn't want to disappoint her, would you? She's right, drunk. Good enough. <laughs> all right all right what a landmark. i want to say well done to that prompt but i Yo, mean what a, what a that, was a prompt. Girl, that was a prompt well done, well. that's a prompt well done Standing well done well done good performance all right now as you can see by the scoreboard fish ye you guys have 1300 funk and lazy of 2100 for this part of the game show funk and lazy you guys won however Ooh. yeah there shadow is realm. this shadow however. realm now, what I didn't you, tell you, know. now what I didn't tell you about this is that all the points that you guys are going to have at the end of this is your starting health bar. 
You guys are now going to go into the shadow room. <laughs> oh and God. basically, you're going to keep fighting everything at each tier until you beat it. Uh, <laughs> and there's two ways to beat them. Either you get it perfectly correct, or you give me a scenario that I would agree the creature would lose to. I'm going to be a lot more stricter on this. It's going to have to be close to the answer. But mm -hmm. that's basically the idea. So every time you lose, you lose health. Every time you win, you get a little bit of health back. That kind of thing. Feel me? So here's your starting health bar, 1,300 and 2,100. Funk, lazy, since you guys have the highest, you get to choose. Would you like to go first or second? Mm. I think second. Yeah, yeah, second seems well, like... I think we, we need to see what it is and yeah, yeah, let yeah, them yeah. take the risk. Okay. Yi, fish, you guys will now be going into the first stage of the Shadow Realm. You guys just have to tell me how you guys would handle beating this creature. All right? Mm -hmm. Behold, the boxing schnozzler. Hey, uh, okay. So, I think we go for his weak spot, his, uh, his biggest... Yeah, I, I think his think nose he... is, like, the obvious part, but also, it could also be really strong. It could break our hands. So, I think what we should do is go for his legs. Yeah, I'm gonna say, the health bar on the legs, uh, like, they're literal... It's a literal pixel wide Like, his hands length. are bigger than his legs. Like his, yeah. Like, feet as well. So, we stay low... Um, and we have to rely on the fact that he can't see us because there's this giant nose blocking his vision. And uh, we just go for some sweeps at the legs, knock him over, and then we just we just take him from there. Yeah, we don't even there. have to use our hands. Like, he, like he's, you know, he's good at with his hands. Yeah, and if like... it's two of us, then I provide a distraction by not showering for a few days beforehand mm -hmm. uh, and building up an odor or a stench, if you will, so that he's distracted by that with his giant nostrils. And he's, he's paying attention to me. He's like, oh, what is that smell? It's coming from over there. And then he goes for the legs and knocks him over. And then yeah, we yeah, just yeah. go at it. Uh, just yeah. Kill him. Yeah, that'll, yeah, that'll him. work, believe it or not. It's uh, anything but the nose. So uh, oh, it'll wow. be minus 200, <laughs> but uh, you guys beat him, so you get plus 200. Good job. Let's go. Let's go. Not uh -huh. bad at all. You beat the boxing schnozzler. That's what it's all about. All right, and, and you get here. to you descend to the second realm. Would you, like to, would you like to go again, or would you like to have Lazy and Funk go? Well, we I, think we go go I think we yeah. go again. I think we go again. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Sure. We simply go again. Super Sanic Buff Guy. Hmm. <laughs> okay. So this is. Hmm. It, it doesn't seem as though this is actual Sonic or Sanic because it says Buff Guy. He just. He. I think. I think on the inside he's a he's a a frail. Is he Sonic though? No, I think he's he's posing as Sonic. Because he's uh, emphasis mm. on buff guy. Okay, so maybe yeah. he's still buff. He's still buff. Do you think he took steroids? <laughs> yes. You know what? Okay. okay. Yes. And yeah, because then, like, of that. Instead of fighting with hands. We're going to fight with our words. And we're going to make And him... our balls. So we, we have a ball measuring contest. His is going to be really tiny because of steroids, right? I thought it was so the cockpit. if we can show that shrinks. our balls are bigger than his, I think we could win. I, I think he's it was very the... insecure because, you know, buff guys are insecure about something. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we, we, we challenge him to a duel, and then he raises his fist, but then we say, oh, no, sir, not that type of duel. And then we pull down our pants, and we're like, so let's go. Show it up. Come on. No. Um, and then he pulls his <laughs> no, down. you're done. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice try. No, you're wrong. What was the answer? It doesn't matter. Uh, lazy, punk, you guys are up. Well, what would you like to do against Super Sanic Buff Guy? Punk, okay. you gotta carry me. Uh, I got brain fog. I'll, I'll try. I'll try. Are, are we allowed to discuss? We, we can discuss before locking in, right? We're not yeah, like yeah, sure. Go ahead. feeling the prompt. Okay, so yeah, yeah, go uh, Lazy, have you ever watched Full Metal Alchemist or like read it or anything? No. Oh no. Ah, uh, okay. Well, there's this character called Sloth, where he moves super fast and he's a heavyweight. You know, he can one shot anything, but he just moves in a straight line. Ah. Uh. And the character spoilers, by the way. Uh, they strafe out of his way to sort, and he just keeps slamming into walls, and they slam him into stuff to beat him. Now with this character, I don't know how like good their turn is, but if we're going off Super Saiyan rules, right? The logic in in Dragon Ball mm -hmm. is like the buff Super uh, Saiyan form is actually worse because yeah, you they're lose slow. speed. Yes. So he's supersonic buff guy, but buff is very important because buff Super Saiyan form, uh, you lose massive speed. This guy, his biggest weakness is going to be uh, presumably reaction time. So obvious way to fight is from the back. You get behind him, beat mm. the hell out of it, the back of his head. When he turns around, you dodge. 
He's going to swing hard and fast, but you just don't give him that angle. I think mm. that's the logic here. Um, mm. he's, pr he's, he's still Sonic, so he's going to be fast, but I think there's going to be a limitation on that speed. If we're being very tactical, we're going to play passive for the first half of the fight. We're going to figure out, you know, his pattern, like a Dark Souls mm. boss. Mm. You, figure, you figure out how it's telegraphed. Okay. Uh, you dodge it, and once you see, like, all right, he can only spin in a straight line, or he can't turn fast... You find that opening, and then that's how you uh, fight. That that's my like initial guess. If I have to be more specific and and say like <laughs> what what are you gonna do? Um, I would I would argue maybe get behind him, swing the hand the the elbow around his neck, do a, a neck lock, choke him out. What if his mm -hmm. tail is long enough for a sixty four Bowser spin? He's that's got a little true. tail. That's a, that actually I like that one a lot too. That tail, that little thing, he can't fight with That's it. That's got to be it's the weak point. The tail. It's so it's tiny. It's freeze the tail. You, There's no muscles you can grab to that. build. Assuming that we can, like, you know, support the weight. I don't know if this is cartoon physics and we can spin <laughs> him, but <laughs> definitively get behind him for combat. After uh -huh. that, tail spin and or neck lock. I think yeah, either okay. would, be, no, yep. would be doable. I think I like the connection. He There's no way he can control his speed that well, so there's got to be an opportunity to get behind him, and that tail is looking meek. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's exactly that's exactly it. Cut the tail or yeah. spin the tail. Either way. Uh, the, the, the main idea was to focus on the balls, tail, which balls. is why I made it, you know, Super Saiyan, <laughs> and then the tail's right God. there. So you gotta oh, cut the tail yeah. and make him normal. I didn't even make that connection. Or yeah. uh, yeah. Steward's made his tail small. Come on. Boy. Yeah. Okay, well, that's no, hold yeah, on. That's another thing right there, but yeah, cut the Too tail. Too bold. Technically, yeah, yeah. cutting the tail only stops the Ozaru form, but it's no, not but implied that he's an Ozaru. If you grab the tail, it makes them immobile. Remember? Yeah, yeah, but you, oh, it's, yeah, it's you're either right. cut it the tail or, or or anything with the tail basically is the the answer I was looking for. So you you got it. You're, you're, you're good to go. Nice. You're good to go. Perfect. It's the only and the lose only any really emeralds just... like objects. <laughs> <laughs> what, what uh, yeah, just to, in case you guys stumble across those, which you did not. But uh, yeah, yeah, you, you, good job. Good job. You got your points no, back. Yeah. So uh, yeah. Now do you want to head into the 300 realm or yeah. do you want to send in fish and you? <laughs> Oh, See, um. I do want to guess, but I also want to watch these guys stumble. <laughs> <laughs> your call, your call. I'm in the back seat. I think we, because if we lose the next one, we're still ahead. I think we do one more and then we pass it off. Okay. Probably. You taking it? Yeah, I say All we right. take it. All right. The Eggy Leggy. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> so that's one leg, Maggie right? Leggy. That's one leg, not are two. These are, <laughs> these are my custom These are my custom Oh, my God. It's an Eggy so Leggy. I, I feel like the eyes are red herring, because, like, it's screaming to me, you know, shoot me with an arrow, Zelda style, but right, I almost right. feel like, I almost feel like that's trying to throw us off. I, I My first instinct would be get the shoe off the Yeah, plate. I was thinking that. It's like a steel-toed boot. Um, like it, like the odd, uh, like the shoe is imbued with a power that m gives him that leg. <laughs> and if you remove the shoe, uh, it see it just goes back to a normal egg or something. The, the question, question is, is, how? is, yeah, strategically, how would you get? I mean, I mean, like, what, what, if you knock him on his side, he can't really get back. Yeah, up. I was gonna say without any other information, his fight pattern seems pretty linear. He's gonna try to like jump kick you. Yeah, too bold. Should we assume that there are like factors that we don't see here? Like, it, can he do laser like, beams? Is there is there stuff inside the egg we don't see that can cut? Like, does he have a fist that can punch out? You don't. And know. We don't see it. We don't know. Okay. Hmm. It's an eggy leggy. Well, we can always. I, I mean, start with the assumption that we're gonna Dark Souls kite him for a while. Can I roll like an insight check and see <laughs> how durable the egg shell is? You know what? I'll allow it. Well, let me let me get uh let me get the dice out real quick. Yes, this is gonna make or break our answer. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, let's see, dice roll d20. Uh, let's see what we got. Okay, you rolled a 13. Not great, but not bad. Um, I would say with that, you can tell that what you see is what you get with this monster. Huh. But not a perfect check. Are we seeing it from the side? Does it only have one leg, or is there another leg behind that? Just leg? the leg. 
Just the one lady. leg. Then, then yeah, you're right, Lazy. I think it's just gonna hop at us, and at that point, you just push it over. I mean, and then maybe, like, maybe pull the shoe off, but I don't even know if that's necessary. I, I, yeah, it's literally almost like too easy that I don't even know what option to pick. Like that, you dodge one, and then it falls over, <laughs> or you push it yeah. over. Like it's hard to pick something that is like correct. Mm -hmm. See, my gamer brain is like, I'm going to knock this over, and then a bigger monster is going to appear inside the <laughs> shell, which is why I'll... <laughs> but, but if we assume it's like, what you see is what you get, I think you knock it over. Are you implying you just to, don't like... Avoid getting kicked. I I think, hmm. Are you implying you that we come should not break above. the egg? Like, breaking the egg is some kind of faux pas? That, I think that's me overthinking, and mm. I think that's me thinking there's Ten a seconds. phase two. Okay, okay. I think you have to jump above it. You have to get on top of it. You can't. If you come from above, it's gonna like jump forward and one shot you and then fall and you lose. I I but say you, all all focus. But if you jump off a stool, y yeah. But right, we have to beat answer? it. You go. You go. You say commit. Uh, you avoid it till you get to high ground. Then you jump on top and topple it. No. Unfortunately, the eggy leggy sees you go to high ground and with its massive, incredibly built leg, springs up and slams <gasps> into you. And, uh, oh my God, but we dodge! Right. We focus on dodging! It doesn't matter. Eggy <laughs> leggy's really good. We uh, well, I mean, you're going to have to go up against it, but yeah, go ahead. Oh, you're sure, in the wait, dungeon wait, wait. now. If we go against How can it, you not dodge help? this? It's the most linear thing. It we saw what you were going to do, predicted you, and took you out. Mm. Yeah. You're up, ye. Do we also lose health? You don't I'll lose health right now. New With its hyper mobility, it was. Fish, what do you Character's think? not dead yet. You, you start us off. I'm kind of. I was kind well, of having that same mindset. The the knees. The knees yeah. are a different color. They are. So we gotta. That looks, put an arrow to the knee. We gotta put an arrow to the knee. Wait, that could be genius because then once you topple it over, the egg breaks. I think that's the whole idea: is that you want the egg to break, mm. revealing. Mm. The inside. Mm. Or, you know, um, if he has, he has veins, you just cut the veins. And so I think we used ranged attacks. And, um... You, you try and aim for the knee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We aim for the knee, wait for it to topple over after a volley of arrows are sent to his knee area, hopefully connecting. Um, we're assuming we're connecting them. Okay. Uh, Is that a final answer? Um, I got nothing else. No, wait, 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 wait. Uh, and, and yeah, as, as he falls over and we're attacking, we untie his shoes. Okay. Um, and, and, and we continue attacking him with his hopefully cracked egg as he falls over. Is that we attack on the answer? inside. So the egg is no, the eggshell is no longer there once he's toppled over. Yes. That is okay. our final answer. So you're untying the shoes after volleys of arrows. To the knee. To the knee, which he then falls over, cracks right, his so egg, and then we attack him. With this, uh, pattern... You notice that uh, as you're firing arrows at his knee, uh, it's actually armored, much like the steel toe of the boot. So That's the arrows fly off. However, after he lands next to you and launches ye 20 feet to the side, you dive and untie his shoelaces, which uh, which beat him. He trips yes! over. Yes! Oh, good job. Yes! <laughs> he got it. <laughs> he got it. We, we, yes! uh, it was, we should have stuck with the first thing we saw. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's, I would it's argue. the only one that's red. I would, argue, I would the argue. You can shoes, you can throw them Hold over. You can push them. Like, Hold what, on. Hold on. I, can you. I object? You have to untie, <laughs> you have no, to no, untie no, the no, shoes me, first. Listen. Otherwise, he won't trip. You said there was only one foot. Yeah. So if you untie the shoe, he there's not trip. a second it's foot to trip. It's physically impossible for him to trip if he has one foot. <laughs> yeah, if he has one you, foot, he's going to step on the, the shoe. No, it's physically impossible it for loose. a one-footed individual to trip on the shoelace. Think about it. Two well, bolts. Why no, no, would no, you trip not... if your shoes were untied? You're no, it's one... because the shoe falls off, guys. The shoe what? Falls off. Yeah, the shoe is loose now. Without the shoe, it just it cracks. That's how you beat the monster. It's it's just got a red shoelace right there. I made it red. Or else otherwise you would just walk around with one shoe I think this shoe DM untied. is railroading us. I think that's <laughs> no. what's happening. My, my second thing was that if you can untie this thing's shoes, you can you can push it over. Like, where's this opportunity yeah, but you yeah, have attack? Specify you have yeah, to specify... I'm sorry, it's not going to kick at him if you, you just yeah, walk yeah, up if, to if him? If we're up it's 20 just, feet on high ground, it perfectly lands a jump that predicts our movement, but they can untie its shoes. <laughs> like, well, it one shots both of us. Hold on, here's the thing. Both of us. But only the thing. He was distracting it. He was distracting with the arrows. When it landed next to Yi, Fish untied the shoes. I was looking for untie his shoes. That's it. Uh, you could have done I'd it in like any to... way. Right. So long as this happens, you win. Too bold. I want to spend a lucky point to, to reroll. 
Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> you already used up your roll for this round. You uh, <sighs> used an instant. You're right. So I have no action. Economy. Economy. Uh, you have no action economy. We should have gone with our gut. We should have gone with our gut. Yeah. Well, gone with our gut. Oh, yeah. Uh, well done. Right. So uh, it's not over. Fishy, yeah, yeah, right? yeah, yeah. Not bad. I'm, I'm, how would you like to go about uh, how about this next one? Would you like to so go he, in, or would you like to I, send in we, Funk we, and Lazy? We almost have to do 500, because if we score the 500... No, 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 you go th straight through the dungeon. You oh, go over the room. Yeah. So we have You're to... at 400 now. Ye, do we, do we bet on them just getting both of them wrong? I don't know. They were pretty good with the Sanic one. Yeah, yeah, but <laughs> it's only harder, and we got the right one. We, we got that barely. No I <laughs> threw in that bullshit line, we untie his shoes, and we won because of it. You never, you never know. You never know. No, you cannot. <laughs> oh God. Um, God. I say we go for it, Ye. Oh wait, wait let's do some math. Nine plus four. Please, oh, God, the math doesn't right. matter. Just, just go. Fine, just fine, let's, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. You guys are going. You're not sending. We them are in? going for it. Four hundred. Right. The underwearsard. Okay, so I behold. Don't think this is, I don't think this is a mental battle. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's think of the patterns that we thought. We, can, we can't make fun of the fact that he's only in his underwear, like a bad dream. Mm -hmm. uh, um, he seems to have powers that he can shoot out of his hands from mm. forward attacks. He seems very relaxed. What powers are relaxed. I see white, red, and orange. It seems, though, it's some sort of fiery blaze of glory that What's he's... The white? The white? I think that's just the aura that's emanating oh, okay. from the fire. It's mostly uh, just a it's just a beam attack. That helps. Okay. I'm noticing he has glasses, so he ta he probably has difficulty seeing. Ooh. What if we take off his glasses? Yeah, I think that's the goal. And then we we pant him, but or his front teeth. trips. I think this one has a lot of weaknesses. He does potentially. Um the mm. underwear mm. What is his name? The underwear Zerd? The underwear Zerd. The underwears are okay. 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 He's a wizard. Maybe in his all this power. It seems that the only power comes from his his hat, and he just made a makeshift cape. But what so if I his think... power comes from the underwear? His name is the underwear zerd. Oh, maybe you're right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well, let's look at his shoes. Your shoes. goal. Your goal is to remove the glasses, and my goal is to remove the underwear once he can't see and can't attack me. <laughs> or or pants. <laughs> It, I, I think that's the way to do it. We got his name is the underwears, or we got to take off those undies. Okay. You uh, um, you have a roll for insight thoughts. if you'd like. Yes. Roll. For what does that mean? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> roll for insight. Or a lucky point. Your choice. Well, what does that do? Lucky choice. Lucky point means you get a chance to go again. Oh no! I, what does the roll for insight do? Just give us. Uh, it gives like you. It gives you a hint. Knowledge. Yeah. Ooh, I think do, we get the insight. Just go again after getting it wrong. No, Ooh. what we 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 get the insight, right? We we yeah, get a hint. Of time. We get the insight. I, I, I think. I, do you really want the lucky? <laughs> ooh, ooh. You know, let's get insight. Let's get insight. Right? Okay, insight, insight. All right, and you roll, and ooh, a sixteen, not bad. Okay, oh, good. Yes, yes. All right, with that roll, it's pretty good. Uh, you know that just just from the look of him, all of his all of his vestments, all of the things he's wearing, are magically imbued, and oh, they're no. probably not coming off. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's think outside the box. Why is he sitting? Mm. He's not wearing anything either. Hmm. Let's make him shit himself. <laughs> let's, make him, <laughs> let's make him freeze to death. Freeze? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, is he in I forget, is is he in a ball or is that just No, this is just design? the shadow realm. You you enter oh, into right. the okay, shadow okay, okay, realm. Okay, okay, it okay. is a, a world full of purple fog and smoke, and out of nowhere the fog pulls back and behold the underwear zard. Okay. Mm. I still think his teeth might be his yeah. weak spot. His glasses won't come off. Hmm. What do you think his powers do? Fifteen seconds. Oh god. Oh, god. god. Okay. So his um, clothes don't come off. Okay. Oh. One of us takes the hit, and then the other one goes for the teeth, pulls off. Oh, no, we, we can't, can't pull, pull it the off. glasses. We, can't pull it off. Uh, Ten seconds. Uh, we knock him right in the teeth. We pull his teeth uh, out. We pull as hard as we can. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We pull his teeth yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, we yeah, become yeah. dentists, and uh, we <laughs> pull his teeth out. Okay. As one so, of us takes the beam. Uh, that was a very fish, educated guess. Yeah, you guys wow. got this. Fish and sprint forward at the underwearzard, saying nothing. They hurl themselves at him. Uh, and they're both hit with a laser beam that launches them 20 feet uh, into a rock. And they're, they're both 
They both take that hit. Yikes, dude. So, uh, so no, not, not, not so good for you guys. Uh, okay. Funk I, plays it. I have you guys want to handle this? Me, I, yeah. I have a lead. Me, me too. You, you first. Okay. I think emp- not every fight has to be resolved with combat. I think this mm-hmm. is like an empathy scenario mm. where we need to strip down to our underwear oh. and then talk to him. We need to be like, talk hey, man, how do you end up in here? And just try to befriend him. Try to like maybe a persuasion kind of kind of approach to okay, this. Okay, and since it's, I'll turn- it's, it's been made, uh, made clear that both, t- both people get an action, right? And I say if that doesn't work, then I will try to search for code words to snap him out of you, it like Captain Underpants. You <laughs> choose one thing that you guys agree to do. But it can be a multi-part attack, yeah. but it needs yeah. to be you one. Have to, you have to agree okay, on what the end result strip is. strip down to our underwear. You give him an empathy spiel while I start guessing random words to snap him out of it. They can be like you know parallel action. Yeah, yeah. yeah it that's, might be a little fine. overwhelming is, for. Is that the idea? <laughs> it might be a little overloading. Yeah. You, you, I'm, I, I'm worried you're gonna freak him out with the <laughs> thing, but maybe I'll, I'll do I'll that. But I'm it. gonna explain. Ignore my buddy. That's just his quirk, and I try to sort of rationalize it. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. In like a very organic conversation. Or you way. could you could even humanize it and say that I do that when I'm anxious. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a that's a big brain move. All right, is that your is that your go to? You try to talk. What was your other idea, him? Funk? I like their idea of freezing him to death, but I don't know what, like, do we have access to, like, infinite objects or only, like, something we could bring with us, logically? Uh, it depends. It'll be up to me. Like, I can't bring, a, a, you know, an AC unit in, into no. this place. No, that would and be I don't have access to any magic myself. Uh, you could, like, maybe minor magic, sure. It's got to be reasonable. That's about mm. the only the only limitation here. Gotcha. I don't think I we would have a, like I'm not coming in here with a freeze spell. Maybe I could okay. raise the temperature, but it, uh, that's a, I think that's a dead one end. last one last free action, please. Since this is all talking actions, if he starts uh-huh. to attack us, even though Funk's doing his empathy spiel, uh, as uh-huh. he like raises his hand to attack, I'm gonna like start making fun of him for being a dweeb. <laughs> Okay. Is that it? Like is the ready to dodge? There you go to? All right. <laughs> no, no. Uh, I, straight yeah, on, no. That's, that's actually it. You got it. It's wow. any kind of Knew it. Yeah. He's, uh, he's embarrassed to be caught in his underwear. Uh, oh, my dude. God. These are my people. Uh, we went immediately. Yeah. We shut down the right answer. Oh, my God. It's just talking. didn't work with the Sonic guy. Oh, oh my God. Not bad. So not we bad. can make fun of nerds, but we can't make fun of buff guys, apparently. <laughs> the double standard. You tried okay. to show your balls. Okay. I'm not going to allow that on there. I'm not gonna allow that. That's not. It not is a form your of balls are not the answer. I'm it's sorry. A form yeah. of social interaction. <laughs> Locker room talk, man. Uh, all right. So last one, the 500. All right. Funk. I think we, we give it, it to lazy. them because we, anyway. we won. If they get it, we win, and if they lose, we win. So logically, we might as well give them it. Right? It okay. doesn't end until someone's beaten it. Yeah. So you could so. both lose. You never know. That's true. But even Ooh. then, when they beat it. We get more information from them uh, do going first. Yeah, let it rip. There's way less risk that way. Yeah, let's let them do it. All right. We should have just let them get the You full shouldn't have fish, let us ye. do it. Oh, my God. This is all your fault. You're this is all up. your fault. I got this. It's this. the spider handler. Whoa. So this is a person that handles spiders. Wait, can I, yeah. can I interject? To make this yeah. more interesting, is it right now, is it actually physically impossible for us to lose if they go first? No, you can both lose. We can both lose. Can okay, all right, all right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you can win. Oh, okay. We can win, ye. Wait, how do they win with enough points? I don't points? know how. I don't know how. Uh, for this <laughs> one, you win. get double. Okay, fine. All right, fine. Oh, uh, well, oh okay. That's great to know. It's good to know that now. <laughs> yeah, Didn't I, need to know that four seconds ago. I might have talked us into this. <laughs> that, no, I mean, I'm fine. I'm there's, still fine There's three this. creatures here. Two of them count as one other creature, so yeah, there you go. Oh, this is so difficult. Oh, my God. Okay, 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 okay. The spider handler. Um, this is tough. So the main one is the big guy. It seems as though he's literally connected to the smaller is there a people. Human or, or he's is there a spider. Does that a, look like it's a the human? spider handler? Okay, so it's some sort of spider being, and it doesn't seem to be a full-on spider, but it can tr- control other smaller spiders. So this is like the one with intelligence, and I'm assuming. It just uses its powers to control other spiders. Bug spray? So yeah, I was I was thinking bug spray, but then I'm assuming the bug spray probably can't kill the spider handler itself. Mm-hmm. Um, 
So we're going to start with bug spray to ward off the little ones. Um, <laughs> hmm. Hmm. <laughs> My body's blank, dude. Spiders wrap their victims in cocoons so that they can mm-hmm. feast on them later. I like the logic. Um, so what would one do in a situation such as this? 30 seconds. Uh, fire also works. Fire? Oh, fire. that's true. Yeah, yeah. We go in with a flamethrower and, and <laughs> we pest control. <laughs> um <laughs> <laughs> we just start blasting because <laughs> it seems as though it only attacks using other baby spiders and i think that's where its power comes from and then if anything it charges at you kind of 15 seconds uh, uh yeah, yeah okay we we, we used the the fuck this is so unoriginal we use the the bug spray on the spiders <laughs> and then we use the flamethrower on the big guy <laughs> Well, you really dug deep for that answer. Uh, yeah, lose. no, that is uh, that is not the answer. the The bug spray doesn't seem to work at all. It just seems to disperse uh, the we second it touches the air, work. and uh, it's completely immune to fire from the looks of it. Uh, it just oh shrugs God. it off. Uh, it then stabs you with uh, the poison, <laughs> and you guys are you guys are sent limping away with uh, green ooze coming out of you. So that's a uh, it's a pretty hefty hit. We lost pretty hefty lost. hit. <laughs> all right, Funk Lazy, how'd you guys like to handle this? So I have a few leading theories. I'm not entirely confident in them. Mm-hmm. Mm. Um, the, f- the first one would be... Uh, so I'm noticing that the big creature, the handler itself, mm-hmm. it has the same build as the spider, but it has the sort of scorpion torso, yeah. which makes me wonder... Uh, this might be like an insight check. Is, the, is that like a natural head? Like that's its real body, or is the head like attached to this body sort of Frankenstein oh, I style. see what you mean mm, wasn't that, you want to use an insight check there is that, is that almost, the almost like is there a weak point around its neck that I, we're just not seeing mm-hmm. sure sure let's see let's see uh, let's see you roll and 17 okay so looking at this creature you know that there's no real gimmick here what you see is a horrifying monstrosity. How big is it? Okay. It is uh, about two and a half meters tall. Wow. That's pretty and big. it's standing on those two long legs? Uh, the legs on its head, and also it kind of has the little hand things down on the ground as well. Are those two really long ones into the spider's ass? That's like a lasso or a rope. That's not like legs behind the spider. So this is a, this is the hands reaching down to the spider, and then these okay. coming out are on the ground. Oh, gotcha. so the spiders are in its hands. It's just holding onto them. It has two spiders on hands. It's a spider then hand. Then my guess, my line of logic in that scenario is maybe get it to bite itself. Like if we can get one of its hands to bite the, the torso, we don't know if it's protected from its own venom. Mm. I don't think that would work, though, because the spider... Have the spiders have like a you know a little stabber that's the same color as the main body, so I don't. My other line of logic would be if we can get it to stab something and turn that venom into an antidote, then we'd be immune. But can I, can they understand us at all? Do Ten they, seconds. Do they speak our language? No. Oh shit! That, there goes my idea. My safe answer is get it to bite itself by like running in a circle and you know get it to fake stab. Uh, okay. I mean, the the legs look weak, but I I don't think we're getting close to break those. Well, if, maybe break the lassos to the spiders. If there's a, if yeah. there's ever an opportunity to attack, I want to pick off the long legs. Okay. Uh, final answer. I'll look for opportunity attack. Or the arms, because they look so vulnerable to just pick, pluck them off if we ever get an opening. Okay. Uh, I'm trying to distract it, get it to bite itself while he's trying to you know cut a leg. Yeah. All right. So you uh, you attempt to fight it on uh, even turns. Uh, it's looks like your attacks are effective, but they're not lethal. Uh, you're definitely heading in the right track, but unfortunately, as you're dodging, uh, you get caught off guard by the tail, and uh, Funk gets ah. stabbed. And as Lazy, or yeah, as Lazy starts chopping away, uh, he does some damage. Uh, it's not enough to be lethal, but you do you do weaken it. 
and uh, it, so you're in saying a cry my, of pain, it kicks you away. So my hits connect, but they don't chop off these tiny twig legs? Nope, they're like iron rods, essentially. Mm, okay. Bendable iron right. rods. Do we have another Damn. chance? Didn't yep. account for that third. Yep, third, your uh, fish. We have another you're chance. back. Oh my yep, God. you're back. <laughs> What's up, the green goo? <laughs> Didn't do nothing to us. <laughs> no, plan? sir. What's, the What's plan? up? What's up? What's the plan? Uh, What's the plan? All right. Okay. Uh, every time you go down, the time limit actually decreases. You guys have 40 seconds. Okay, so the legs, legs weakened it. Legs weakened it. Legs weakened it. Um, I think that we... What if we convince the baby spiders? Doesn't speak your language. Not work. It's not going to work. You're going to try diplomacy now. It does not understand your language. We offer one of ourselves to be controlled as a spider, and then just as he's about to Again, put his hands on us, it does not offer. It does not understand your language. But it is just a monster, and it wants to kill you. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Okay. So spiders, right? They. Uh, they eat you by wrapping you in a cocoon, right? I did mm. say this, yes. So one of us has to go out. One of us has to go in the cocoon. Preferably you. So you sacrifice yourself in the cocoon. <laughs> okay. And then while and they're you you know, busy like wrapping you around, right. like I'll pluck off all their legs. Okay, so I'm going to go just lay down on the ground <laughs> and act <laughs> like bait. And then as they're wrapping me, which we're hoping it takes a good amount of time, you, Not the heads. you <laughs> break off their legs. Uh, we break uh -huh. their legs. <laughs> um, I think honestly, how like can we squish these spiders with our feet? Like, yeah, how big are they? Can we just stomp them? Let's stomp them out. Just keep like keep, yeah, what if you ever seen spider you ever seen spiders? No, the main thing you is two and a half meters tall. It's a they're pretty big. You can't. You're not going to be stomping yeah. on them. Two and a half meters. Damn. Okay. Um. Well, we're three meters tall, so we could just stomp on them. <laughs> Sorry, did you grow an extra, like, I don't know, seven feet? Fish and I are very tall. Ah, oh, I see. <laughs> Ten seconds. Uh, yeah, what do we do? Yeah, I think, I think I go into the cocoon. You, yeah, you I, just try I, to I try snap off. Legs. Yeah, and while they're rolling me, I, I roll with them. Like, I roll <laughs> in the direction that they're rolling to throw them off, and it kind okay. of, like, so throws off their your, tempo. Your option ultimately is fish lays there, and then he attacks. But then I also spin. I also spin <laughs> while... <Very important>. <laughs> <laughs> while <laughs> the he, he's, suddenly okay, undo, so. he's suddenly undoing its work, so it takes yeah. really long. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. <laughs> yeah, so uh, I don't know where you got this idea that they even had webs, because there's no webs. So you just lie down and then they stab <laughs> you. Oh, they just stab the shit out of you. No, and, just uh, spider-like creature. My downfall. Yeah. How do you kill these guys? Yeah, man? so you get stabbed a bunch. Yi attacks them, and uh, believe it or not, Still kind of effective, but it doesn't seem to get the job done. Well, why? Why? And uh, you get launched away. Them. This is a layup. I got this. All right. All right. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. You guys take the hit. Uh, funk. Lazy. I got How do you this. handle it? All right. So, we we understand now uh, that we're probably not, like, they're iron rod, right? Probably impractical to try and cut these, even if we had, like, Jaws of Life or whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Even if they can't be destroyed, they can be immobilized. He's got two really long kind of rope hands on these spiders. Mm -hmm. These spiders can only attack each of us one at a time, presumably. I don't think they're going to both go for one. So if you distract the left one, I distract the right one. And then we're going to sort of like, I'm going to jump over your head while you run to the right. And we're going to make him spin those, hand, those spider hands around. We're going to pretzel him. And we're just going to keep, you know, pretzeling the long limbs and hands until they're totally immobilized by their own lankiness. Hmm. Mm. So, I mean, mm. I, I feel like the fundamental the strategy you're putting down is that we, we fight from opposite ends, forcing it to... Yeah, it can't, it can't get closer to either but, I mean, of us because it's what if it equidistant to both of us. But what if it just decides to fight one of us and then, like, apparently I'm not allowed to hit it in the back because its tail is, is sentient. Um, <laughs> what is what? Look, I'm just gonna how, say, like, no one. How big is the attack roll? <laughs> Twofold. Huh? <laughs> like, does my AC cover this attack roll? <laughs> uh, you're gonna get hit if it hits you. Okay. 
Uh, uh, I was going to say, like, that's tricky, tu then. Tubold has, didn't protest at all to arrows, didn't protest to uh, flamethrower. Can we just shields. shoot a Fallout mini nuke at this thing? <laughs> <laughs> you do not have access to a mini nuke. <laughs> Lazy. What? Lazy, I couldn't bring an AC unit. <laughs> yeah, but they brought a flamethrower and arrows. So a volley okay, of you... arrows, mind you. They paid a mercenary army to shoot a volley of arrows, and that was fine. <laughs> All right. I think shields. I think that mm. way, if it does go at one Ten of seconds. us, we buy enough time. But the main goal is to keep it distracted, and we pretzel. Okay. Okay. Limbs. So yes, we we split directions, and if it ever chooses one of us, we are very careful with the tail, with the shield, and we hack away at the the yeah, the legs. I I would even phrase this as we are avoiding getting an attack range. We are simply trying to yeah, go to Yeah, we force to, to it chase. to have to completely commit to one person. Well, I, that's mm. not what I was saying, but Wait, sure. well, because we're splitting, mm. right? How do I want to... That's not forcing it to pick one person. That's just... Okay, are you saying that we outrange it and, and use arrows like the, like forever and it never hits us? How do you not understand? I'm saying... <laughs> <I'm> sorry! <laughs> I feel like... I'm not crazy, right? All right, it's go so... Yeah. Okay. So agree on an attack. You have to agree on an attack right now. Otherwise, it just Trump, comes over okay. and stabs you guys. Funk, go ahead. We're trying to get it to wrap itself in its own long limbs. Yes, okay. So okay. we stay out of range while, while splitting its attention via being in the opposite ways, and we keep kiting it until it loop-de-loops. Loop yeah. We're okay, kiting so it. So you're, you're kiting it and trying to get it to spin around itself. Okay, got it. And if so. it does commit, we heard it in the back. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a shield. Yes. Okay, we're going to go with the first part of this. And basically, you guys attempt to make it twine itself in its own legs. However, uh, it's very deft at handling its body. It's been running around on its legs you know, its whole life. Uh, right. And it just it pivots perfectly. And it Dang. just manages to stop your distraction and just, just hit you. But and it had to commit to one of us, right? It doesn't matter. You, you, well, the tactic it of doesn't matter, but around How does it not work. matter that You're its right, back but, is turned but to one Hold on. For the sake uh, of strategizing later, okay. what does its attack pattern look like? Yeah, what the hell is going uh, on that it's so good? How is he that good? Does it try pattern... to attack both of us at once, or does it focus on one? Uh, it it kind of just does whatever it can. It's got. Wow. It seems to have like three sentient heads. It just it just looks at you, and then it just you guys both try to run in different directions, and it just slams into you, and you get launched away. Uh, the distraction did not work. Mm. Damn. All right, so uh, Fishing Yin, you're up. Last chance before you're knocked unconscious. Oh yeah, you guys are gonna Wait, die. So the, are the little spiders his hands? Yep. Well, okay, we 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 clarified that he's holding on to the spiders. Yeah, yeah, they're also <laughs> yeah. like sentient kind of, but he's 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 the handler. He handles them with his hands as his hands. They are spiders. He's got to <laughs> shove up the I, spiders. I, I, I'm just hearing both things all the time. <laughs> Basically, he could just use his hands as hands, or they also it's like fine, understandable. Yeah, yeah, it's like a Kermit the Frog. It's like a Muppet situation. Okay, he yeah. up the spider's yeah. ass. Okay, exactly. Sure. Controlling. It. <laughs> All right, fishing. You're up. Hmm. Hmm. Since you've both gotten to this point where you you've lost, and the previous hints didn't work of uh, that I've given. Uh, let's see. We're gonna make another roll for you, real quick. <laughs> Next round. Uh, okay. It is a nine. Okay. Um, even after all this, you know, uh, you know what's effective. That's for sure. Do we though? Yeah. Fish wool is effective. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I, you know I what's not you. effective for sure. But you this also is our know what is effective. <laughs> we, might hey. win, we might win, so watch it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. So he uses the spiders as his hand puppet things. Mm -hmm. Going for the legs was somewhat effective, but it didn't stop him. Mm -hmm. So maybe going for the limbs is, is, is just in general what we have to do. Um, I think we go for his spider hand things. Uh, but the question is, how ye? The co that, that's the next question. They look for skinny. We could just... 15 seconds. Mm -hmm. I, uh, so he does a lot of damage. I swear you guys have tried attacking the limbs like three times. <laughs> can we just, can we just uh, dodge his attack so he keeps punching himself in the face and, until he dies? That's yeah. pretty much what I did in the first. Oh. Um, 10 seconds. Oh, God. 
Go for the eyes. <laughs> okay, good. seven. What Drax did in uh, Guardians of the Galaxy? We we get eaten, but like we open from his stomach and kill him from the Ooh, inside. Oh, I like that. I like that. Yeah, yeah. 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 We we get eaten, <laughs> and we definitely we're live as we're being devoured. Are you sure you don't want to lie down first? Inside. <laughs> then we. Kill I have a theory. The if they don't get it, I I still want to try after. Oh yeah, yeah I mean, we have gonna, to. Yeah, can, we can, yeah you're True. gonna go until you, you're done. All right, yeah, so we, so you're trying to attack it from the inside. We exactly. jump into well, I jump into the spider's yeah, first mouth from the head team. first. Okay, so with knives in, in my hands. Okay, and I'm inside the spider. Was, inside is soft. Yes, okay. and so I start scratching away with yeah. my knives. <laughs> sure. Which I mouth? Can't think of anything else. What'd you say? Which mouth? Um, you mean the mandibles. The, the y y y uh. That was a hinty. Uh, the, uh, I, I think we it was go not a hint. into. You, that's a terrible plan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Basically, yeah, fish, you dive towards what looks like a mouth, only to realize it's just a pinching, stabbing mandible. It just bisects you, essentially. Oh, give us and, thirty uh, more seconds. Give us thirty more seconds. You're 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 dead, and uh, Yi all alone uh, attempts to attack it. He's not uh, inspired which... by that display or anything? No, he's actually terrified because <laughs> uh, Fish was bisected so easily. And then he gets stabbed through the stomach and the tail comes out the other end. And uh, yeah, you, you'd, uh, you you both die. Oh my God, and that's, so that's the end. So uh, yeah, Lazy, Funk, you guys have two tries left to beat the spider. What's you your know idea, it's effective, Funk? you know it's not. Okay. So it was established that the spiders aren't necessarily hands, right? It, it is attached to the hands, but presumably the spider is an independent entity from the large creature itself. Is that what we can, like, surmise? Yeah, sure. Okay. Now, the tricky part of this is we don't know how tough those pinchers are. <laughs> but Very if, tough. Each of us, if each of us had, like, a metal rod, like a really unbreakable one, mm -hmm. we could sort of goad the spiders into grabbing it, to pinching mm. it, and then using that rod, we try to pull it off of the mm. handler's hands. Interesting. What I mean? Using some kind of mm. reflex that it has. We're, the goal is to remove the spiders from the handler. The question is, will the spiders hold onto the bar, or will they let go? I'm going to reiterate, to from the very beginning, for your very first insight check, there are no gimmicks to this fight. Well, he keeps saying that we damage it when we attack it, but then it's never enough. So I, I that's what keeps me stumped. Like, are we supposed to just target focus the hands one at a time, keep our distance and attack the hands? I mean, yeah, I, that's a logical theory. It's just, it wasn't conveyed to me. That I felt like if we attack one spider, then we have a tail and another spider capable of responding it's not All like right. a and we, we don't seem are, allowed is each part of the body turn based in this combat <laughs> <laughs> like how are we viewing this you guys are both up it's your turn i mean can I we still don't can, feel like I, what if we're on either side of it again going with a bit of the split up uh strategy but we're we're just focusing on on staying out out staying out of the range of the hands but like in range to attack them, not, but not that they can like lunge at us. Like, just focus on killing the the little hands first, and then the the rest of the fight should be easy. Yeah, I would say battle of attrition. We're putting all our focus on one part at a time, starting with the spider hands, and you know, at range if possible. Do I have a rope dart? A rope dart? How about yeah? Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? You have a rope dart. <laughs> yeah, so I can stay uh, twenty feet away <laughs> from it, but throw sort of this blade on a rope to hit it. And okay. we're just trying to whittle it away. Okay. Are you both doing something akin to that? We're both playing the kiting game, yes, and focusing on the hands. And you're both attacking at the same time. Uh, that seems like some kind of weird hint. Yeah, I don't like the phrasing of that, but I don't see what the alternative is. Yeah, when we split up, it didn't seem to do anything. Uh... Like, if we wait one at a time, what, is, what occurs? What I, I, don't I don't see a benefit, see a benefit either, yeah. I don't think we have the time to discuss it either. I think yeah, we're, we we're... just want one each to be pulling the aggro of one hand at a range at which it's forced to do that. Okay, so yeah. you're both attacking. Yes. Okay, that's all you needed to do. You just needed to attack at the oh same time together. God. Don't be scared and lock in. That's You oh, just needed yeah. to both oh attack God. it. 
That's oh all that God. needed to happen. Oh I God. said at the very beginning, there's no gimmicks. <laughs> just go in. I even said it's effective when it was just one of you hitting it, but it wasn't enough. <laughs> you just had to both attack it at the same time. Oh my goodness yeah. gracious. That's it. Just don't be scared and lock yeah, in, boys. That was time. it. That was <laughs> it. Congratulations. You slaughter the spider. You both walk sense. away. They, they killed 2,200 points. Yeah, but you both had to attack it together. No lay down and die. No <laughs> try and, no try and distract it with by spinning in circles it just it just both attack it together and cut some limbs that's all you had to do i don't know never seen me play D &D because i i I live for convoluted i know which is why i put four of them before this guy he was the he was the big bad of just hit him the other guy was talk it out last guy is just hit him we should have picked up from the talk it out you know just an inverse there you go so that is there you go funk lazy guys have won you beat the game. Congratulations. Did we escape the Shadow Realm? You guys walk away from the Shadow Realm while Fisher the, never the cloistering purple smoke takes ye and Fish's bisected and stabbed body and drags it into the void. Wait, do we get their again. inventories? Uh, no, but you do get no. uh, resistant to poison and uh, weapons that uh, now do plus one and poison damage on a D8 if you hit, the, hit a one or an eight. Dude, so I'm are we doing eight milestone? Now. Are we doing milestone levels or XP levels? Uh, we'll have to see until next time. But either ah. way, you, you did pretty well. So, good job, guys! Congratulations. Oh, I... <laughs> well done.